in need of a crafting fix. There are so many ways you can watch Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Sewing Street is live from 8am to 1pm every day on Freeview 72 and Sky 670. Alternatively, if you want to watch us on a tablet or on the move, you can tune in on our YouTube channel, the Sewing Street app, or the websites at www.sewingstreet.com and www.yarnlane.com. You can watch past shows on Sky 670 from 1pm every day, as well as our YouTube channel, the app, and our website. Yarn Lane is on from 12pm to 1pm. Visit our programme guide to find out when and what's on. So you never have to spend a minute without us. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Hello everyone, my name is Cara Ackerman and I'm absolutely delighted to be here at Sewing Street. Um, I actually originated from Hertfordshire, then went down to Hampshire and then it ended up in the East Midlands. I've been in the East Midlands for about 40 years now, which seems crazy. Um, but 36 of those I actually worked with DMC Creative World, um, which was wonderful. I really, really enjoyed that. And then um, I decided to go freelance and that's how I got introduced to Sewing Street. I love doing anything to do with um, textiles. So embroidery, cross stitch, patchwork, done a bit of quilting, bag making, toy making. Oh goodness, there's loads and loads of things. Um, what I love doing is just trying something new. And I think one of the tips is don't be frightened of trying something new. Um, you always learn from it. And you know, don't be scared of making mistakes either. We all learn from the mistakes that we make. Um, little bit about me that you might not know and that's a bit of a surprise. Um, I once went to the garden party down at Buckingham Palace, the Queen's Garden Party, for some work that I did with Marie Curie. I was so, so lucky to go there and just a wonderful time. Um, so I hope to see more of you on Sewing Street and I hope to try lots of new crafts with you. So see you again soon. Bye bye. Good morning and welcome to Sewing Street on this frosty Sunday morning. Oh, it's a cold one out there, isn't it? But at least the wind has died down a bit. Well, it has down south anyway. Don't know what it's like up there. We did get quite a good flurry of snow yesterday, but nothing settled. So there was no snowman building, unfortunately. Anyway, anyway, on this lovely frosty morning of, of Sunday, Hannah's laughing at me for the full weather report. If only I had a weather map behind me and we could do the full. In fact, if you could just all message me in what the weather is like with you. If anyone's got snow, I want pictures. So jealous. Um, yesterday, we had a special day. It was 10% off everything. It was so popular. We had so many lovely messages from all of you. You all really enjoyed it. So we thought, you know what? We'll do it again. We'll do it again. So, um, if you use the code yesterday, it's on the screen at the moment, BF2021, that sounds like Black Friday, I think, BF2021, or boyfriend, or best friend, but it's no, I think it could be whatever you like, Black Friday 2021. If you used it yesterday, that's absolutely fine, you could use it again today. Now, the way that it works, that you can put it, you can um, put things in your basket, check out as many times as you want, put the code in when you want, and... Um, the money, the 10% will be taken off everything at the end of the day where, at midnight when all the baskets are closed. So if you use the code yesterday, don't worry, you could use it again today. You could use it at any point today and everything in your basket. Now, it includes everything that's on air, on the website, sewing machines. The only thing it doesn't include is gift vouchers. So it works across Sewing Street and Yarn Lane as well. 
Now, we've got loads of things that we've had black tag offers, we've had clearance items, we've had special sales, discounts, bundles. On the website, we've got clearance sections. It doesn't matter about any of those. It is 10% off everything. So even sewing machines, sewing machines. So you know those like really, really high priced, expensive sewing machines, 10% off those. So it really is, so only gift vouchers, the only thing is excluded. Website sales, TV sales, Yarn Lane, Sewing Street. And it was so popular that we had a word, we had a word with management and said, can we have that? I said, well, because it's not fair, because I wasn't on yesterday. I'm only on today, so can I have 10%? So it is 10% off everything day to day. Any questions you've got at all, message the studio and we'll, we'll our help. Or if you phone the call centre, they're brilliant. They know what the, the offer is, they know what's happening. They'll be able to explain if you've got any questions at all about that. Anyway, as a celebration, we have two, not one, but two black tag deals today. Remember, 10% off them as well. So number one is this pair of beautiful sewing boxes. Well, they look like just normal sewing boxes. They stack. They feet, they're both fabric covered and they feature really bright, colourful. Should I turn them around so you can see them properly? Um, beautiful coloured owls, brightly coloured. Now, I've, they come unfilled. I need to say that now, Hannah said, make sure you tell them it's unfilled because I filled this one up because then it looks nicer. So in this one, look at that. This is the perfect place for storing your threads. Or if you wanted to gift it to somebody, you could put your threads in it. Now, I got all the threads that I put in here out of a box of threads that we will be selling on air today. I'll show you those in a bit. So if you want these identical threads, you can buy the box too. But let me show you if I take some out. It comes with all these little grooves. How much is that? $29.98. That's for both of them, by the way. That's for the pair. Um, are we going to drop the price, Hannah? Oh, oh, how much? £13.98. And do we get 10% off that? Wow. So if you use the code, you can take £1.39 off that. So £13.98. You get, but I'll show you the other box in a minute. Also, so they all fit these. So you are saving £16 plus the extra 10% off the normal price. If you want to then use this just as an ordinary sewing box, you could take the plastic insert out and then you could use it, which well, doesn't have to be for sewing, could be used for anything. Lovely gift for somebody. Nice, you know, when you're buying somebody a gift voucher or book token or something special, and you want to put it in a nice box. Perfect for that, because you don't have to have the plastic insert. But these are your normal, like 100 meter sewing spools. They're the, the Gutterman ones, so just the standard ones that they fit. Now that's one box. Both are come in the same deal. It's not one or the other. They come together. Um, the other box, I like this one because this is all for the one, these two boxes together. This has little spaces for putting all your um, bobbins, either filled or unfilled. Again, the insert comes out if you want to use it as a normal storage box. So what a lovely gift for somebody. Or if you were thinking about organising your storage, have all your threads in one, wind all the bobbins up, put them in the other one. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five. Enough space for 30 bobbins. But what a beautiful set of boxes. So for £13.98 plus the 10% off, if you remember to put the code in, you get both boxes. That's a fantastic price, isn't it? Absolutely fantastic. And look, they stack beautifully. They're slightly padded, so you've got a cotton fab um, fabric outer. It goes all the way around as well, it's not just on the top. They're slightly padded as well. <laughs> I'm all tangled up now. Don't, yeah, don't twist them round. Right. And then they feature as well. Should I turn it around and show you? Look, little clasp, little metal clasp that opens up. So with the 10% off, that is £12.59. £12.59 for two boxes that will store all your thread, all your bobbins, or you can just use them for general storage as well. But if you used the code yesterday, don't worry, you can use it again today. But only yesterday and today, that's it then. I'm not sure that they'll let us get away with it tomorrow. 
So it really is just yesterday and luckily today as well. But if you've used it yesterday, that's fine. You can still use it today. So that's our very ultra special black tag offer. I like the fact they're slightly padded because you could put pins into them as well. Beautiful. What a beautiful deal. But they'd look nice on the shelf, wouldn't they? Um, but you know what it's like, or if you've got your sewing kit, maybe you've got just like your basic sewing kit that you keep in the lounge for when you're sewing, watching the telly. You could keep a few threads, scissors, um, needle case, pins, all your little EPP shapes, or your latest project, or just all your remote controls and a packet of Maltesers, perhaps. Which I think would be a nice thing. Minstrels, actually minstrels are the best thing if you're sewing, because the chocolate doesn't come off on your fingers. And it's really annoying, isn't it, if you're eating Maltesers and you're sewing and you have to wash your hands. Whereas minstrels, perfect. Is that melts in your mouth, not in your hand? I think that's the advert, is it? Or is that a different chocolate bar? What's the chocolate bar with the jingle goes, melts in your mouth, not in your hand? I think it might be minstrels. <laughs> Mm, I'm going to think about that one. Anyway, we have got another black tag offer. This is this is genius. Beautiful pair of scissors called Measure and Cut. Really um, lovely quality. They're soft grip handles, comfort grip. grip. Um, they're stainless steel, very, very sharp. You could use them for sewing, general crafts, household use. But they come, look at this, with the tape measure. Now, the full normal price for these is $13.99. What are they today, Hannah? How much? <gasps> no way! $4.99 and you can get 10% off that. So it's like $4.50 then. Wow. But these aren't just any old scissors. Look, they have a um, tape measure that slips into the handle that you can take out as well. Look, retractable tape measure. Magic. Right, there are three different colours of these, either teal, black or red, and you will be sent a random colour. They are 22 centimetre scissors. The tape measure, oh, it's 150 centimetre tape measure. That's nice long, isn't it? So that will, that does come out. I'm, I'm, they, we couldn't find another one, so they wouldn't let me take, take them out of the packaging. But the tape measure, the tape measure will slip out, so you can, you don't have to measure things whilst holding the scissors. They're lovely. I tell you what, these are a brilliant present. I mean, there's a lot of you already who have multi-bought. You know, if you're thinking stocking fillers, because they're they're not just for sewing, you can use them for you know all household uses, paper. Um, sewing, any household use at all. Everyone so far has bought them as multi bought and I think they're great because stocking present, four, what do we say, 450? That's an amazing, if you use your 10% voucher, they'd be like 450. Amazing price. Uh, stocking fillers, just an extra little gift for somebody, for yourself. Lovely to always have an extra pair of scissors and they are beautifully sharp. And look, they come in three fashionable colours as well. And I think that's quite useful because it does say that they've got easy wipe clean blades. So if you are going to use them for the kitchen, you know, for chopping your bacon or cutting up toasted sandwiches, very useful for that. Pizza, really good for pizza. You can then use your tape measure to measure the slices to make sure that everyone has the same size slice. But with your, so four ninety nine, but with your 10% off, that's £4.50. That is a fantastic deal. Put them in your basket and don't forget to check out. Now, you can check out as many times as you want. Pop your 10% off code in BF2021 and then that will um, apply all day. So don't worry, if you put your code in now, it will still, They what they'll do is they'll look at your basket at the very end at midnight and the 10% will be taken off everything. So you haven't got to choose. It will be off your whole basket. That's a fantastic deal. Wow. There are loads and loads of you. I don't. I think we might well sell out of these, so please do check out. Oh, Hannah's got a price comparison for us. Just so you know. Oh, actually, that's quite good because it's got a picture of all the three colours there. So, elsewhere, they are discounted to £12.58. So those are the three colours. You, it will be random. You might get teal or black or... It's like a raspberry red, isn't it? 
but they are mainly white. It's just that the, the colour is the tape measure and the inner bit of the handles. Nobody's quite discounted them to 4 99 plus 10% off. That's amazing cost, isn't it? I think I quite like a pair of these. Uh, fantastic. Genius that they've got the tape measure in. Because then hopefully you remember to put it back in afterwards and then you'll always know where your tape measure is. Mm, look at that. Genius. Four ninety nine. That's fantastic. So that price, if we've got any left at midnight, will go back up to the twelve ninety nine. Don't forget. We had hundreds of these, mm, but we haven't any more. We've sold over half of them now. So if you do want them, um, if you've got any problems at all with your code, if you've got any questions, phone the free phone number 0800 001 4433. They will be able to help you or just message studio at sewingstreet.com and we will be able to help you. Love a question, love a message. Oh, yay, got my pair ordered. Thank you from Chantel in Dorset. Brilliant. What are you going to use them for? That's what we're about. They, that's what we're about, is giving you fantastic deals. Next message. Good morning. Catching up after being at a craft fair yesterday. And yes, it was melting your mouth and not in your hand, feeling a tad old. They go, see? see? I knew it was minstrels melting your mouth and not in your hand. And it should have said, perfect for sewers. Because quite often, the other day, I was having a chocolate brownie and I was doing some crochet and I actually had to get, get up, wash my hands with like a carry-on, otherwise I'd have had a chocolatey crochet hook. Should have bought some minstrels. Mm. Thank you. Thank you for confirming that one. So, coming up today on Sewing Street, on our 10% offer day, is 8 o'clock. We've got even more black tag offers for you. Loads. And we've the, those are the offers that have got... a discount on them anyway because it's black tag but we're going to take and you get 10 percent off that as well we've got a whole selection of i'm just having a look at the table books and fabric and general sewing supplies that's eight o'clock at nine o'clock we've got the lovely Cara ackerman who is with us she's going to be demonstrating how to make a gorgeous snowflake embroidery purse very simple embroidery and the kit is brilliant because in the kit you get the instructions and the clasp and the bit of string which is very important and all the fabric and the, th the fabric that you need to make it she's going to be showing us how to make those perfect for this wintry day lovely gift gift as a kit or to make someone for christmas there's still time 10 o'clock more back black tag offers more discounts and obviously 10 percent off that one as well um, different things in all of these black tag hours so please do make sure you watch all of those so that you can see the different offers that we've got because we won't release them until the hour. 11 o'clock, Cara's back with us making the beautiful Sewing Street gnomes. We've got mummies and daddies and babies. Look, there they are. That's the dad, that's mummy and babies. Kits for all of them. There they are. She's going to be showing us how to do that. And we've got kits, beautifully printed fabric panels with instructions to make your special gnomes. Again, perfect for your Christmas decorations. I've got two of them. They sit either side of my fireplace at Christmas and they look lovely. They look very nice on a little chair or on a shelf. Or brilliant Christmas presents. You can use them as toys. You can use them as doorstops. They're fab. Anyway, Cara's going to be showing us how to do those at 11. And then 12 o'clock, even more black tag offers for you. Woo! Woo! So, I'm going to move over to the other desk. Actually, I'll take my thread with me. Oh yes, website, website. So if you want to shop with Sewing Street, the easiest way to do that is on the website, um, www.sewingstreet.com. If you click on watch live, there we go, you can see everything that we have got on air today. Early bird, today's bestsellers. So if you have a look on today's show deals, that is everything. Everything that we have all that I've already talked about on the right hand side, there's pre order. That's everything that I will be talking about. So, if you want to get ahead, I mean, look, there's one that's already sold out. But ev everything else on there, um, we, when you look at the price there, we may well be probably will be dropping the price below that as well on the black tag hours only. So, um the price that you pay that is on there, you won't, if you buy that now, you will still only pay the price that we drop it to later. And obviously you get your 10% off. But obviously what happens is that 
you know, all a lot of these things sell out. So if you want them, please do scroll through what we've got on offer so that you can get ahead and get it. Remember that the, on the black tag hours, 8, 10 and 12, those prices will be dropping. So, but even if you check out now, you will still only be charged what the lowest price is. And don't forget to put in your 10% off code. Look, there's everything that's coming up. Loads, loads and loads and loads. So as we look at that through the day, you'll see more and more that have sold out. So don't forget to use your 10% off code. If you fancy a sewing machine, today is definitely the day to buy one. Right, mode, uh, merry and bright. Seeing as this is my weather day. Please send me a snow picture if you've got any. I really want some snow. So this is a gorgeous, gorgeous layer cake. Hang on, I've just got to move this quilt that's on the floor. There we go. In my way. Right, the Mo mode of Merry and Bright. Now these are, this is a layer cake, 10 inch squares. I think you get 42 of these, 42. So the price for this, the full price for this is 44.99, mode of fabric, 42. We are taking 10 pounds off, 34.99. Remember, if you use the code, you will get 10% off, you'll get £3.49 off that. So you've already got £10 off it, you'll get another 10%. Should we have a look at the gorgeous fabrics in here? I'm not allowed to take these out, so we'll just look very carefully. We've got fun snowmen, we've got dots. This is perfect for your Christmas quilt. Maybe you want to make a Christmas tree skirt or do a table runner. You could patch these to do a table runner. Look. But you know, if you've already done all your Christmas makes, start for next Christmas. I'm thinking patch these together to make a beautiful Christmas tablecloth. Oh my God, can you imagine a patchwork Christmas tablecloth or a table runner? You've got candy canes, you've got white dots, um, there's Christmas wreaths, love the stripes. Now there are more, more of you who have got these in your basket than we've got available. So if you want this layer cake, you need to check out now because the fast, the quickest people that check out get it. I like the green serum, that's a lovely green, isn't it? Green, green spots, that's gorgeous, isn't it? Next. Right, I have to find these things. Words to live by. What does that one look like? This one. Right, another one, another mode of layer cake. Words to live by, again, 42 10 inch squares, full price $44.99. We're going to take £10 off that for you today, as it's in the black tag. I remember it's £34.99, plus you'll get your other 10%, your extra 10% off that as well. So look at this layer cake. Beautiful shades of coral, peach, charcoal, pale pink. It's all floral, florals, graphic, you know little stripes, you've got the low volume, you've got the large prints. These are beautiful fabrics. I love that colour. It's a lovely shade of sort of ochre, goes beautifully with the peach and the purple. Look at that print. That's gorgeous, isn't it? And we've got shades of navy in it as well. So everything, obviously, because this is a whole fabric collection, all goes together beautifully. <gasps> are you going to lower the price again? No. If you've already checked out, don't worry, you will pay the low price. So, so far we've had £10 off this. £29.99, under £30 for a Moda layer cake. And remember, you will get an extra 10% off that as well when you use your code. That's a fantastic price, isn't it? That's a beautiful set of fabrics. There's even, there's black ones at the bottom as well. Gorgeous. Oh, I'm allowed to take this one out of the packet. Does it mean if I take it out of the packet, then it's mine? Yeah, I don't think we can get that back in, can we? That's such a shame, isn't it? So let's have a proper look at these. These are beautiful. Now, there are loads and loads of different books and patterns available to use layer cakes. We've got, have a look on our website. We've got quite a few. You've got beautiful shades. Really, really summery. I've never seen a Moda layer cake for $29.99. Don't forget your 10%. Look at the beautiful floral print. Love this one because that coral goes so, it obviously matches beautifully with the large floral prints. 
I know, I mean, and life does carry on after Christmas. You know, but when the, isn't this lovely? I would think, I'm, I'm thinking bed quilt, actually. That's what I would make with this. Because it is beautiful, isn't it? Look at that. But, you know, if you wanted to make, if you're thinking next year, I've got a special birthday, special anniversary, somebody leaving home, somebody setting up their own house, you want to make them something special, this is beautiful. There honestly are, there are loads and loads of different patterns using layer cakes where you piece and cut. I can't believe this is $29.99. Well, I mean, but obviously you don't have to make a whole thing from these. You can just keep the fabric and use the different pieces for different things. You can make 42 zip purses. Which would be fine if you're going into crafts, craft fairs. This is beautiful. So if you use the 10% off code, it'll actually be £27 for a Moda layer cake. I mean, it's gorgeous, isn't it? It's beautiful. Quarter of the stock has already gone, been checked out. Oh, the Merry and Bright. Um, layer cake has sold out. That's gone. But that's beautiful. Now I've got this one. Can we do the smaller work version as well? Please do carry on um, checking out for this big one because half of it has gone already. I can love that one. Actually, I think that's my favourite one, that one. It's beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Obviously, beautiful moda quality weight quilting cotton fabric. Oh, that's a nice one, isn't it? When you look at them together, you think that's beautiful. And doesn't that go so nicely with that one? Look at that. Gorgeous. Lovely. Now, oh, that's an amazing price, isn't it? I want that one. Be that is lovely. Now, if you like the prints, but you want a smaller, let me just put those to one side, if, but you want a smaller print, smaller pieces, we've got the same one, but in little pieces. Now, these are five inch squares, 40, 42 of them, exactly the same prints as the big one. Now, this is normally $14.99, but Hannah is Dropping the price today to eleven ninety nine for the charm pack forty two five inch squares. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Love that. Words to live by. Beautiful shades. And if you use your ten percent code, you'll get one pound nineteen off that as well. But why wouldn't you use the code? But again, you know, we have lots of books and patterns. If you just have a look on the website for using the smaller charm packs and the bigger layer cakes, there are only eight of these left. So if you want one, you need to put it in your basket and check out. These are gorgeous, aren't they? Beautiful quality. I think sometimes if you've not used mode of fabric before, then treat yourself. You will see the quality of them. Right. Let's have a little price comparison. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that is amazing, actually. So that's eleven ninety nine, which is great if you want that, you know, if you want the little ones. But, so look at that, you get four, obviously, four of them, four times as much, and that's $29.99. Which doesn't make sense because you get, look, four times, four times as much fabric. That's an amazing deal. Just to show you, that's our own personal price comparison. <laughs> yeah, I bet that was a Hannah price comparison, not an, not an external one. We've also got it in a um, jelly roll. We can call this one a jelly roll. So if you if you love the fabric but you want the jelly roll, now the a jelly roll is pre-cut, if you haven't seen one before, two and a half inch strips. They are cut across the full width of the fabric, so they'll all be 42, 44 inches wide, which is about 112 centimetres. Again, there are 42 in there. 40. 40 in there. They are all the fabrics. Let me roll it around and you can see. 
all the fabrics that I've just shown you in the main um, charm pack and layer cake. $44.99 full price. Again, loads and loads of book patterns using these jelly rolls. $34.99. $34.99 for the whole Moda jelly roll. Plus, you can get £3.49 off when you use your BF2021 code today. So this really is your, I want to make a gift. I want to do something. I want to treat myself to some Moda fabric. I will be sewing, there will be sewing on going on after Christmas too. Or you want a nice project to keep you busy over the Christmas holidays. In case you're not busy enough. Oh, and we've also got a panel from this collection. Right, let's have a look. What's on the panel? So if you've bought the charm pack or the layer cake, wouldn't it go beautifully with this panel? I'm going to give it a shake. Wow, this is massive. I'm going to hold it up. Can you see? Because I can't. So what have we got? One, two, three, four, 16 different panels. Can you see the bottom? Oh, hang on, we've got a picture. Oh, there we go. There's a picture. So you get 16 panels. So you can cut them out and use them as like individual cushions. Does it say how big they are? I'll just get my tape measure. Right, each panel measures hmm, 10 and 3 quarters. Maybe this is a wonky tape measure. Yeah, um, 11 inches square. So you can use them for cushions, tote bags. You could quilt the whole panel because it says buy flowers, give more than you get. Because this collection is called Words to Live By. So these are sort of sayings of good things to do and be. When life hands you lemons, make lemonade. I mean, you could even use it for the backing of a quilt, which sounds odd because it'd be on the back, but if you're using it for something that you're going to see, it's lovely to have something like this on the back of your quilt. Be kind whenever possible. It is always possible. So you could use them for individual things. You are strong. You know, if you, use, if you had these as a centre of um, a cushion, you could put a board around the edge. So if you've bought maybe the, um, the jelly roll, perfect to put borders around the edge or you could use the charm pack or the layer cake you could make a quilt using these panels into space with borders or other patchwork blocks oh we're going to lower the price everyone belongs 11.99 dream do repeat use what's right in front of you oh i like that one that was just So that's um, five pounds we've taken off and you can take another further one pound 19 off that one. Look, this one's lovely, isn't it? Just a sewing one. So you've got some sort of slogans that you could use if you wanted to gift them as cushions or bags or make it into a whole quilt, make the whole thing into a wall hanging. We've got um, a rainbow. I love the heart one. Happy heart makes a happy home. So much value in this, isn't it? I mean, it would look beautiful as a whole quilted wall hanging, but if you were going to make them to individual things, that's um, a bird. It's, I think it might be um, a swan. There's a swan. Be yourself. That's lovely. Take a deep breath. Exhale. You've got this. Inhale. I like that. That's gorgeous, isn't it? What a lovely panel. It's beautiful. I mean, it's absolutely massive. And I tell you what, feeling it, it is beautiful quality. It drapes really well, but it's ever so, ever so soft. It would make a lovely quilt back, although it would be a shame to, to hide it, wouldn't it? It's lovely, isn't it? But you could use the block, block on it. Um, you could applique the, one of them onto the back of a denim jacket. What would you have, Hannah? The sun. Oh, no, I like when life hands you lemons, make lemonade. And look at that. I mean, Len, you know, some of them, they don't all have slogans. Look at the butterfly. You could embroider that one. <laughs> yes, Hannah's advice is embroider over this, cross out lemonade and put gin. <laughs> <coughs> when life hands you lemons, make gin. 
Does it say then, P.S., buy your own distillery first? So these, these all go together beautifully. So we've got the panel, we've got the layer cake, we've got the charm pack, and we've got the jelly roll. What a fantastic collection. I love the panel. The five-inch charm pack has now sold out. There was only nine of the design rolls left. And there's only ten of this beautiful 10-inch charm pack. So if you want these, you need to get them in your basket very quickly and check out or they'll go. I love the panel. I think that's gorgeous. Sort of thing, I'd buy that. Not absolutely sure what I'm going to do with it. And then in a couple of weeks' time, I'd know exactly what I was going to do with it. It always happens, though, doesn't it? It is so soft, though. It's just beautiful. I like that. I think that's my favourite one. Don't forget the code. Don't forget the 10% off code. But don't worry, you can always, if you forget now, you can always go back in later and pop it in. So that is the Moda one. Should we do the rest of the Moda? Oh! <laughs> yeah, that's no, right, I just dropped the jelly roll. Jelly roll fell off the table. It can stay. Panels! Did I? Oh, these two. Sorry. <laughs> I've got two more panels. But they both come together. So, this is one of them. Henry, I was going to say what, but these are Henry Glass, mid-century. Oh, isn't that beautiful? There are two. You don't just get one, you get both of them. So there's one, and here's the other one. These are gorgeous. I'm feeling like I want to cut them into stripes and use them as borders. But then they work lovely the other way as well. So the stripes run vertically down the panel just like they do in that photo, if you want to know which way they go. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Look at the colourways in them. In fact, they're so stripy, they're making the screen go funny. So you've got the bluish colourway, and then you've got the pinky colourway as well. I love this. So £19.98 for the £2. They're both half a metre. That's a good price, isn't it? Because Henry Glass is beautiful quality fabric. No. Are we dropping the price? What's the price being dropped to then, Hannah? Hang on, well, let's have a see. It's the price. $12.99. $12.99 for the two half metre beautiful Henry Glass panels. That makes them $6.50 a panel. That's incredible price, isn't it? And obviously, you get the further 10% off that as well if you use your BF2021 code. Best friend. £12.99 for these two beautiful panels. I love them. The colours graduate from really deep, deep aubergine all the way up to sort of brighter, brighter pink. And then they go back again. So they, they um, mirror. They start off at the selvages in the dark colours and then all the way up to the light ones. So you've got loads and loads of different colours. If you're making something and you want different shades of pink, it's all in here. You can use it as one whole piece. You can cut it into stripes and use it for borders. But the fact that you get both of them, both, for £12.99, I mean, they're just stunning, aren't they? This is where when you're making something, whether it's um, quilting or homeware, the fabric is doing the work for you. You're, whatever you make with this, it will look stunning because the, the colours are in there. I love those. I mean, I think, actually, I think the picture on screen there, I think it is, is a good representation. Sometimes the colours don't come out as vibrantly as they really are because these are beautiful. But I think on there, they do come out really well. Quarter of the stock has gone already. Don't forget to use your code. Remember, it's not just, if you've just tuned in, I know you're going to get bored if you're with me all morning, me saying this, but there are a lot of people who just pop in here and there. You don't have to choose what item you use that code on. That code is on everything that is in your basket and checked out between now and midnight. And even if you used it yesterday, you can use it again today. It's not one use only. But that's it, I think. I don't think we'll get away with having any more 10% off days. So it really is yesterday and today, and then that's it. What should we do next? More moda. Hustle and bustle. Hustle and bustle. Oh, how much is this one then? 
This is all all reds and greens and checks. Oh, this is lovely. Little people. This one's got little people in it. So ten pounds off, and this was forty seven ninety nine. Um, this one has this now thirty seven ninety nine. This one is now sold out. But for the those of you who bought it at the full price, you won't pay the full price. You will pay the thirty seven ninety nine. I'll add that to my pile. Happy days. I think this is the final mode of fat court, um, layer cake. Happy days by Sherry and Chelsea. So this is shades of pink, green. Look, this is very springy, isn't it? You've got like little daisies, tiny little prints, little leaves. I love that beautiful, very, very clear aqua blue background. So this is a lovely colour palette of pinks, greens and aqua. So the full price for this is $44.99. We've got peachy colours and then you've got, you know, look at these lovely strong corals. If you have, if you're looking at this on the website, the picture on there, they I think they've put in the five inch charm pack, but don't worry, you are getting the ten inch one. The descriptions may is correct, maybe not the picture. Then you've got lovely taupe shades that blend beautifully with this, and you've got that lovely deep sort of, more like a French navy colour, not a bright navy, and that's also all of those prints are repeated all the way through. So you've got navies, taupes, mustard deep coral, paler coral, that lovely clear turquoise. And so you've got a few designs and they're repeated in all the colourways. You've got a lovely diagonal stripe, which is quite unusual, you don't often see fabric with a diagonal stripe. I like that. Gorgeous. This is the lower pr lowest price we have ever sold it at, £34.99. And don't forget, using your BF2021, you get £3.49 off it. Woo! So that's amazing, $34.99. This is perfect for your quilting for next year or as a brilliant thing to do. And in fact, if you get it soon, this could be a quilt for Christmas. You can get, get it done in a week. So that's the last Moda layer cake that we have today. Which one next, Hannah? We have got three Moda jelly rolls. Which one is that? I so, oh, I like that one. I like looking at them like that. You can really see the, the colour spread. This is lovely. This is real. Shades of almost like red, white and blue, but be, but not as bright as that because you've got shades of green in here as well. So it's very, very floral. You've got, you know, this sort of lattice look with roses in amongst it. So that's $44.99 at full price, but obviously this is a black tag hour, so we are going to drop the price. Right, this is, so we're allowed to take it down to $35.99. But, but Hannah's hoping that no one is watching, not you, obviously, but those people who tell us what we're allowed to. We're, let's hope that nobody who says that what we're allowed to do is watching. $29.99! That's an amazing black tag deal. And obviously you will get £2.99 off that as your 10% off. That's, and that is a beautiful design roll, isn't it? Oh, I think you might get in trouble. You better hope, Hannah, that, that none of management is watching this morning. Actually, to be fair, it is 8.40 on a Sunday morning. They'll still be in bed. They won't know. They won't know. Well, look, this is called Sunday Stroll. And it is a Sunday, so that kind of makes sense, doesn't it? But I love this one. I love the colours in this because they are they are your sort of classic red, white, and blue. Pick. I'm thinking picnic quilt. Mm, it's it, it's looking like picnic quilt to me. It's the lovely. I love that shade of green. It's a real sort of apple green, isn't it? And then with the navies and the and the reds, and they're not super bright reds. They're just sort of real classic clear reds. Look at the stripe on that one. This is definitely. Oh look, Annie Gingham. I knew this is a picnic quilt. Well, obviously, obviously you can make whatever you want with it. But that's those sort of colours because that's the colour of the sky, isn't it? I love that one. So that's Sunday stroll, twenty nine ninety nine. 
Right, we only have 14 of those left. So if you want one, you need to get it in your basket. 29.99 down from 44.99. Whoa, plus extra 10% off. That's a fantastic price, isn't it? That's your Sunday stroll jelly roll. Um, the next one. Which one is that one? Flowers for Freya. That's gorgeous, isn't it? So very, very limited on this. This jelly roll is in shades of teal, um, chartreuse, grey. So this was $44.99. We are reducing this one to $34.99. We don't have many of these left at all. Oh, that one's actually sold out now. I'll add that to my sold out. I'm very busy. And finally is Sophie's... Sophie's, the label is hidden, so I don't know. Oh, it's just called Sophie. I thought I thought it was Sophie something. So this one is in shape. You've got the lovely taupey grey colours. You've got reds, pinks, and again, that beautiful, it's a bit lighter than the other one, a sort of a limey apple green. Some with floor, flowers, some with dots, some with um, trellises, and you've got whites as well. 34.99 beautiful for a quilt for your bedroom have a quick look before you buy uh, your patterns to see how many you need oh there's only three of those left because sometimes you need more than one so there's only three left of those that's a beautiful jelly roll loving that one i think sunday strolls my favorite but there are more people that want this than we have available so if it's in your basket check it check it out fat eights fat eights this one, mode of fat eights. This is called the Mill Creek Garden. Very limited, very limited. So in here we have got, there will, a fat eighth is nine by 22 inches. It's a fat quarter cut in half, basically. There are, how many in here, 40, 35. This should be 59.99. Look at the colors in this. You've got shades of, Oh, this should be $74.99, but it's $59.99 from $70. That's amazing. You've got beautiful shades of rich buttercream and violets and this lovely light olive. And then you've got the darker, darker brown there. I mean, that's, that's bluebell wood, isn't it? Is there only one left? Only one left. $59.99. And don't forget... Five ninety nine off with your ten percent off BF twenty twenty one code. Right, I've got a bundle of PU fabric. Now there are PUs and PUs. Emma and I were discussing this this morning. Love this PU. This is like your butter soft PU. There in this bundle there are one two three four five six six half meters. So we've got aubergine. Now this is a beautiful, you know when you get those really expensive leather or PO jackets and they, and they call them butter soft, that's what this is. It is beautifully soft. It's got a fabric back. So if you were using this to make a jacket or a skirt or something, you don't even need to line it. It's beautifully soft fabric back. But this is lovely. It's beautiful to cut and to sew as well. If you are making um, leather accessories like handbags, things, it's very, very soft and very, very pliable. So it works ever so well. So in this bundle, if you, you know, if you've started bag making or you want to add to your bag making supplies and you want to treat yourself to some really good quality soft PU, this is the bundle for you. So we've got half a meter of aubergine and then we've got half a meter of gold. Now this isn't your really bright, bright gold. This is a really nice, subtle, pale gold. It's got a slight texture not textured to it, but textured look in it. Again, you've got that lovely fabric charcoal backing as well. So £41.94 is the all full price. We've got navy next. What are we going to drop it to, Hannah? £34.99 for, for six half metres of PU. So we've got aubergine, gold, navy. I'm going to have to put them a bit closer together. Then we've got um, like a slate grey. 
lovely. Really lovely to accessorise clothing with as well. If you wanted to put some patches on things, really lovely. If you're making bag making, but you bags and you want to just do the base or the bottom section that has the box corners in a PU, it's perfect for that, or the whole bag. So with this stash, you can use them, add it and use it for lots of things. Black, and then finally, chocolate brown, but it's more of a um, plain chocolate than a milk chocolate. Crashing again, crashing again, $29.99. Aubergine gold, navy, grey, black and chocolate, $29.99 and the width of this, which is quite important to know because it's wider than your normal fabric, um, where did you put my tape measure? Oh, I hung it back up. I just want to check because I can't remember what the actual width is. So it's 140 centimetres wide which in um, old money is 55 inches. That is a fantastic selection, isn't it? So you know when you want to, you want to make something, but you don't know, you're not absolutely sure what colour you want or how it's going to go together. I mean, you could use the na those fat, the um, aubergine and the gold look beautiful together. So you could make your bag from the aubergine, put your little straps and your edges in the gold or the other way around. Although they, 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 in fact, that gold goes really well with all of them. But it is a really lovely, it's a matte finish as well. So it looks expensive. It is a lovely quality PU. Right, a third of the stock has already been checked out of this bundle. Remember, the price goes back up of this at midnight or until obviously we sell out. And then we can't put the price up anyway. But that is beautiful, I'm thinking. I'm thinking this is a nice thing to have. Make yourself a, a patchwork, that's what I'm thinking, a patchwork skirt. I've got a really nice pattern for an A-line skirt that I've made in denim, but wouldn't it look nice? Pieced in PU. Mm. But at that price, it's worth experimenting, isn't it? Next. Sashko source book. Books. Right. I think Hannah's talking to me in code. <laughs> talking to me in code. I don't know what she's on about. The ultimate Sashko source book. Now, this is a brilliant book. I don't know why we're discounting this. Because it's really popular. We always have it in stock. Everyone loves it. And it sells really, really well. And it's, it's a fab book. I, one of my first shows I did was with Susan Briscoe and we did this and one of her new books as well. And it's brilliant. It tells you ev everything. I don't, I don't know why it is. You know, people are always a bit funny. I was talking to my husband yesterday about Black Friday. He goes, yeah, it's a load of rubbish Black Friday, isn't it? Because um, I was reading and it says you can buy most of the stuff cheaper elsewhere. I went, well, that's just a load of rubbish because on our Black Friday, we sell stuff that we sell normally. And I said, naturally, we've got 10% off everything. So how does that work? Well, I said to him, do you know it's Black Friday? You know that um, you, you want to buy something and you, want, you should get it on, your black, on the Black Friday. Oh, no, it's a load of rubbish, that. I went, well, it might be in other places. But I said, I know that we discount stuff on Black Friday that we normally sell anyway. So this is normally, I mean, this book is, if you've never tried Sashko, this tells you everything from the history to the designs, to the technique, to the ideas. It's got projects in. It's even got pictures of old things. Every pattern you want. It is a brilliant book. I mean, this is written for complete beginners up to people who have tried it before, want more ideas and more things. So if you've never tried it, this is the book for you. It is the ultimate book. So normal price, $9.99. No. Normal price, I'm not listening, you see, eleven ninety nine, Discounted price, £9.99. So that's £2 off plus an extra 99p. With you use your BF2021 code. I don't know why this isn't. See, this proves the point that Black Friday is not a scam. The RRP of this is £15.99. Whoa, look at that. Should we just zoom in? Normal price, £15.99. Today, to you, to me, to you, £9.99. In fact, £9 with your discount. So £15.99 down to £9. 
And it is a brilliant book because it, it does explain everything. Why, why Shashko was used, tools, materials, patterns, everything. It's all in there. And it's beautifully explained as well. Right, now we're going through my library. One moment. The little Beth Studley's mini patchwork projects. Which we normally sell anyway at eight ninety nine. So normal price eight ninety nine is going to be today six ninety nine. There are how many projects in here? Six projects. So with your discount, that's you take six nine pence. So that's almost just just a little bit over a pound a project. It is beautiful picture garland if you've ever used any of the best studly projects you know how beautiful they are how inspired they're all really unusual lovely ideas if you've bought any of those lovely layer cakes mm, perfect little tr trinket bowls that's a lot of value in here for just over a pound a project beautiful little pin cushion this is a real stash buster do not chuck away any of the scraps of your fabric. Look at the little needle case. There is so much you can do with them in here. These are just absolutely charming projects. I love this one. That's a lovely gift for somebody, isn't it? Because they all slot together. It's the sort of thing, actually, you know, when you've got things like this on your table and you have children around. Can I play? Can I play? It's like a jigsaw, isn't it? You could just make lots of them. I love that. But it's beautiful, isn't it? There's a lot of work in these, a lot of com really detailed, but you're only making a little project, so it's a really good way of practising your skills. I love the notebook cover. I think that's fab. That's a great present because the pen holds the notebook closed. Really, really easy to understand. You can see that all of the diagrams, all the instructions, gives you all the fabric you need. And then in the back, she covers all the techniques. Amazing, six ninety nine. That is fantastic value for money. Also, you've got um, all the templates. And what I like as well, it shows you here, it gives you the web address for you to download the patterns. So instead of ruining your book or having to trace them, the patterns in here you can download, which I think is quite a nice touch. So that's Beth Studley. Next. <laughs> yeah, next. Two winter panels. Hannah's laughing. Why are you laughing at me, Hannah? Next. <laughs> I think I think I'm going too fast. Hannah always tells me that I treat this show like a buffet. I go through it as fast as I can. Look, we've it's five to nine, isn't it? We've got a lot to get through. <laughs> I don't know why what, what Hannah's like at a buffet, but she obviously thinks I go through it really fast. Well, if you don't get all the volivons and the cheese and pineapple on your plate, straight away somebody else gets it. You, when you get to a buffet, you have to treat it like a battle situation. <laughs> so this bundle, is it both of the panels in the bundle? Both panels in the bundle. They're exactly the same, they're just different colours. So you can use this as a big wall hanging, but I, I like the fact that there's all these individual squares that you can use for other things that I'm thinking gift tags, centres of table mats, hope, faith, peace, joy, believe, love. So the two panels are £12.49. pence. Whoa, that's very good, isn't it? That's amazing. So you've got it in this lovely, um, like an evergreen, evergreen green, and this really lovely um, cranberry red, I think. But they would look beautiful. You cut them out. You could use them, you know, you maybe take four of them and put them in the, as a cushion. Lot of, they'd look really lovely as your Christmas cushions in the home, wouldn't they? Christmas coasters, centre of table mats, card making. You know, if you just took um, even the little squares, take out the little square. If you've made yourself some table mats, cut the little squares out. Sew them to a piece of card, gift tag. Very nice. 
And then all the edges you could use for the borders of things. So this is Moda as well. Warm Winter Wishes for Moda. Both of them, so you know they're beautiful quality. But look at the size of it as well. So you haven't got, you've got all of these twice. Right. Let me just fold these up. These are whizzing into baskets. This is your classic, bring it out every year, set of Christmas table mats, I think. Well, you can use them what you like. What, let me know, let me know what you're gonna use them for. Always interested. Right, I like these, because they're tied up with string. I find that lovely. So, in this packet, you have got four Fat quarters, and these are lovely. Now these are normal price, twelve ninety nine. So you've got a very sort of a open woven linen, very very pale background with white spots. You've got the same, but with hearts instead of spots. And then you've got one with brown spots, and then you've got a gingham. But they're really nice, thicker, like um, canvas. No, not canvas. Sort of halfway between a fabric and a canvas feel. Even the um, the gingham is thicker than your normal cotton. They are now being reduced today on the special black tag deal to £7.49 for four fat quarters in beautiful neutral tones. That's less than £2 a fat quarter. And don't forget, you'll get the extra 74 pence, 74.9 pence off, off the fat quarters. They are lovely. Nice little addition to your stash, actually, aren't they? really useful for things because they're lovely neutral tones. I love this one because instead of spots, it's got hearts. So please do keep checking out with these. All of the items I've shown you, a lot of you have got them in baskets. You need to check out because many of the items that we've been through already, there are more people who've got them in baskets than we actually have in stock. So that is the um, Naturals Fat Quarter Pack. I've got the same thing as well, um, but in red, but it, the fabrics in this one are slightly different. So you've got a fat coat of hessian, so you can use this for lots of different things, lovely for gift bags with a bit of applique in. So you've got hessian, you've got that lovely linen look with red hearts, you've got a nice red gingham, and it's a woven, not a printed gingham, so it's beautiful, it's got the real sort of cream background not a white background and then oh, I'll show you the top of that one and then that's like a snowflake one but it is perfect for rustic decorations gift bags but it is thicker than it's like a linen-y type with a real texture to it and I like the fact they put the um the hessian in it as well that's seven pound 49 so any kind of craft making this is the sort of thing you also often see card makers use as well beautiful you know if you've got someone who's starting off sewing and you want to start them off and give them a few um, little pieces of fabric things to get them go with give them some ideas one of these packs is brilliant £7.49 or even both of them now there are other things that we haven't had time for because I wasn't allowed to go as fast as I wanted to through the fabric buffet <laughs> because I just I'm not allowed to go really really fast apparently you can't keep up because yeah, otherwise they can't get the graphics through. But anyway, there are lots of other things. Have a look on the website. Going on to www.sewingstreet.com. Click on Watch Live. And if you scroll down, you will see everything that I haven't had time to go through and you will see all the offers there. Um, we're going to go for a break now for a couple of minutes to get um, all of Cara's items on. Do have a look on the website in the break. We'll, we'll play a couple of adverts about how that all works um, while we're just getting ready for the next hour. But there is obviously the 10% off works off everything that's on the web shop as well. And it works on Yarn Lane. Don't forget, it works on Yarn Lane too. 10% off. Think of all those lovely kits on Yarn Lane that you would love to have 10% off. Anyway, thank you for joining me for this hour. I will be back in just a couple of minutes and Cara will be showing us how to make this beautiful snowflake purse. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans 
and Yarn Lane TV fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there! Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street and Yarn Lane, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. For Sewing Street, head on over to www.sewingstreet.com. Scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. It's exactly the same for Yarn Lane. Head on over to www.yarnlane.com. Scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and that's it. You are now subscribed to both Sewing Streets and Yarn Lane's email newsletters. So you'll never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433 and for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Follow Sewing Street and Yarn Lane on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. We know that shopping online can be a confusing and sometimes daunting task and sometimes all you want to do is talk to a human being. Well our family run customer service team are on call 24-7. They're full of friendly, warm-hearted individuals all trained to make your shopping experience as easy and as enjoyable as possible. And not only will they take your order, they will also help and guide you on your shopping journey so you never miss out. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. 
We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos, and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Welcome back to Sewing Street. We, it is the Snowflake Purse Hour, which is ideal, isn't it? Well, yesterday, Carl and I were both thinking, I wonder if we'll be able to get here. We thought we were going to be snowed in, and then it had all gone. Um, so we thought this was ideal, the Snowflake Purse. Now, this is beautiful. I'm going to show you here. This is the sample that Cara has already made for us. Isn't that gorgeous? Now, if you love embroidery, this is going to be great because this will be easy for you. It's a really simple project, but beautiful. It is stunning in its simplicity. But if you've never tried embroidery before, again, ideal because it's a really good starter project. In the kits that we've got, I've got four different colour choices for you. There is everything that you need to create this, which is brilliant because you get the clasp and the string and the chain. And I'll show you that in a moment. And Cara's going to talk us through how to do the embroidery, which has got beads on. But obviously, you can do whatever embroidery you want. You can choose. You can make whatever. You could put um, initials on it. You could put your own different embroidery. But what she's going to show, most importantly, is how to put the clasp in. It's something that a lot of you ask about, think, you know, because it really does finish it. I always think when you're making a bag or a purse or something, it's the hardware that finishes it off, gives it that professional look. So in order to get this beautiful, neat finish in this little purse, Cara's going to show us how to do that. Isn't that gorgeous? Got a chain, optional. You don't have to put the chain on if you just want it as a purse. And, and, oh, she's got some wood in there. It is fully lined as well does not come with the wadding. That's just for the photo. So let me show you the um, bundles. I'm going to go through the one I just showed you first. So kit number one. Now you've got to choose the colourway. This is going to be the difficult bit. This one is aqua. So let me show you first because obviously each one of the kits has got the instruction and hardware pack. So I'm going to go through one of them and then they will be the same for all of them. So this is from um, Zaka Workshop. Now we've had quite a few of their books on air before. They're really lovely. They're, the, the detail in the book, that's the main thing with the Zaka Workshop projects. There's a lot of detail, a lot of tiny detail, which gives them that beautiful, well obviously homemade look, but also really sweet and very designer look because it is such tiny detail and it's beautiful. I think what they go for more than anything is simplicity and it really makes the design stand out. So here in here we've got all the instructions, tells you exactly how to make them, how to cut everything out, even in you know really lovely diagrams of how to attach the beads. You've got also, this, so these are the instructions. You've got in here, I like this, that you have a separate template. This is full size, no enlargement is required. And it's got all the placement lines for where you put everything. Now, obviously, if you decide you want to do your own design on, what's lovely about this is that you've got this sewing line and the seam allowance line. So that if you decide, well, actually, I would like to put maybe on the back of it, because we, we haven't put anything on the back of ours. If you wanted to put someone's initial or another design, you could trace this and then map out what design you wanted on it as well. So everything is in here, including the seam allowance, and very, very easy to see where you put things, even the marks of where you do the seams which is the most important part of making one of these class purses is where you do your seams up to really very very clear easy to understand instructions then full color very step by step walkthrough pictures of how to do the class now Carl's going to be going through this as well so by the end of this with the instructions as well you will be a genius at putting in these metal class so that's something what you've always wanted to learn, this is the kit for you. So you get the full instructions. You also get the, obviously, the metal clasp that goes across the top. You get the chain. So if you don't want to put the chain on, it's got little um, clasps that you can take it on and off should you want to. And you get the string. You think, why is, where's the string used? The string is the important piece that you use to push inside the edge of the frame with the fabric and that's what holds it in tightly. Very important that the paper string that you have for that. So that's in that kit. Uh, this kit is 1899. 
Oh, 10% off that as well. Take off £1.89 when you use your BF2021 code. In the kit as well, it isn't just, that, that's the instructions and the hardware that you need, but you also get, is it a fat quarter? Yeah, a fat quarter of this gorgeous aqua linen and a fat quarter of pale blue cotton fabric that you use for the lining. So for eighteen ninety nine, you get all the instructions, you get the hardware, you get two fat quarters and one of them is this, this lovely textured linen. I think that's a fantastic price. Right, that's the aqua colourway. Now, we've also got, ooh, I like that one, the charcoal. That's nice, isn't mm, it? Very nice. Mmm. I thought the two, they go together beautifully, don't they? I like that. Pewter, yeah, I'm going pewter. Yeah, because it is more of a sort of a purpley grey. It is grey, but it's the purple end of grey. So obviously you get the instructions with the hardware, but then you get the fat court of the pewter grey for the outside and then a fat court of the grey for the lining. That's the pewter colourway. We've then got blue. Again, you get the instructions and hardware. You get a fat court of the blue linen. It's a lovely textured. It's almost got a pattern like a print in it. And then you get a fat quarter of the blue lining. And finally, we have the, what's this one called? Stone. Stone snowflake. So you get the hardware, you get half a fat quarter of this beigey, taupey, stony colour. It's a neutral colour. And then you get a fat quarter of the cream for the lining. So all of those sets go together beautifully, don't they? You've just got to choose what colour you want to use. Now, if you want the set on its own without the bundle, if you want just the instructions with the hardware, we have also got that for sale just on its own at 14 99 14.99. Wow. So that makes those two fat quarters four pounds then. Wow. That makes the kit extremely good value, isn't it? So 14.99 if you want to use your own fabric. Obviously, once you've got the instructions, you can use them time and time again, but you'll only get the one clasp with it. Lovely. Right, the, what you don't get in the kit is you don't get the thread and the beads. But, luckily, because you might want to choose your own colours. So we haven't put them in, otherwise you won't be able to choose what you want. But if you buy them separately, you can choose. Um, let me show you, start with beads. These are the beads that Cars use. These are a size 6 seed bead. This is 89, so we've got these available in two colourways. £4.50, Debbie Abraham's Baby Blue Size 6 Beads. Now these are lovely because they're bigger than your normal seed beads, which makes them easier to sew on. But also, they really stand out on the snowflake. Now the colour that um, Cara's used on this one is the other, is the other bead. Is the... Um, I can't remember what these are called. The next one is this colour bead. Pebble. That's it. So the one that um, Cara's uses is Pebble. So we've got the baby blue and the Pebble. They're very similar, just pale blue and pale grey. But these are really good size beads for this project. £4.50. Now, the embroidery th thread, we have got a bundle of glitter. In this bundle of glittery thread, we have got um, silver, blue, gold, and like a Peacock, I think, like a teal. This is, is this the stranded metallic, Cara? The light effects? Light effects. Yes. Oh, yeah. This is your DMC, I knew because she's used it. You, this is your DMC light effects thread. So this is a stranded thread, but it's metallic. It's beautiful. You get, how much is it more? One, two, three, four, five, six. There'll be six, six, but they are twisted, so they do okay. come there on. There are six yeah. strands in each one. There's eight metres of thread in each skein, 
but they are beautiful for stitching with because you get a really lovely shimmer to your work. You can combine them with stranded cotton if you want to, but these are gorgeous for sewing with. And you get in this bundle for 7 99 you are getting four eight metre skeins. Peacock green, gold, a lovely sapphire blue and silver as well. So if you want some beautiful sparkly threads to put onto your embroidery, that's a brilliant pack. Then we've got some stranded cotton which is the, um, I like this shade, it's like a pale grey but with a hint of mauve in it as well. Um, 35. That's not white. 27. 27. It's not white. It's not white. It is like a very, very pale, mauvey grey colour. And it works beautifully. In fact, it's not white. It's a bit like those paint colours. It? <laughs> it's, it's like a silver, it's like a real light sort of but just it a hint. It looks almost slightly mauvey grey yes. as well. So it is it's it works actually beautifully with all of the colourways. I mean if I put it onto the grey, doesn't it look lovely on that? There's a really good because white would be too stark for some of these colourways, but this shade number twenty seven is lovely. So that's perfect. That's enough to do the purse. I'm more you could do many purses with that one. We've also got some shashko thread in this one is cream. But you can use this. It's up, entirely up to you what thread you use to do the embroidery. But lovely little Christmas gift for somebody, I'm thinking, who likes making a purse. Nice kit to buy somebody. So if you bought them the pack with the thread, thread with the fabric and the clasp and the instructions, then all you'd need to do is buy them some beads and some thread and they're ready to go. £1.79, you can do the embroidery with this. That's the Shashko thread in cream. And then we also have it in white. You will need needles. If you look on the website, if you look on the um, the Sewing Street Watch Live, under that we have got cruel needles, which you'll need, and we've also got glue. We'll talk about those as we go along. But let's get on with the demo. So, morning, Cara. Morning, how are you? Fine. Where was the snow? Um, Did you ours came any? yesterday, yesterday mm. morning. I went shopping and I thought, oh, I'll get the shopping done before anything hits. Went into the store, was going around the shop and looked outside snow and then by the time I got home there was a little bit but by the afternoon it had gone but how about everybody else I hope everybody else is nice and safe yeah did it just disappeared didn't it I had the it massive did. snowstorm yes. not one flake settled really not one no I got a little bit of settle but not uh, I mean some parts of the country I know have been really badly affected well I think it was the wind wasn't it yes Yes, so um, I'm hoping everybody's staying safe and mm, staying stay inside. indoors. Yeah, stay indoors and keep it's warm. It's perfect, perfect yes. day to stay inside. Definitely, and so. And so. Mm, <laughs> and just think about the snowflake when you're stitching Indeed. this design. Yeah. So, have you used these instructions before? Yes, yes, I did um, uh, about a month or so back. I did um, a couple of the clasp purses. Oh, okay, so you. So they're lovely. What do you think? Oh my gosh, yes, it makes it so easy. I want to try and get through to doing the gluing bit so okay. um, I'm going to try and cover as much as I can you know a bit of stitching mm. um, the first important thing is really just transferring the design onto your fabric okay um, but if I can say at the moment that um, the fabric that you've got in your pack although it's a fat quarter of linen it's extremely wide and you can get three purses wow. from that fabric Wow. So from the linen fabric, you can get three. I think from the um, because the lining fabric isn't so wide, you might need a little bit extra. But you you must have stuff in your stash. Yeah, so everybody does. Yeah, um, that's really good, isn't it? So you can get three purses, okay. but obviously you only get the one clasp. With yes, that one. if you've got yourself extra clasps, there's plenty of fabric, or you could make matching items. Yes, yes, or put together. You know, you were saying about gifts. What a beautiful gift to you know mm. give somebody for them to make. So. I often buy, buy people kits, yes. even though they don't sew. Yes. But I feel it's time they learn. Or kits for lots of things. 
<laughs> or put together kits, even if it's like a cooking kit or something. Yes. Because I love a kit. Oh, gosh, yes. Something kit. different, something mm. new. So anyway, so I, what I want to do is just talk you through um, how to transfer the design. So um, the instructions are really clear, really, really clear. And so you have your um, template here. And what I do is um, with this particular design is actually use some tracing paper. So I'll pop that over the top and um, just trace around that rather than cut the actual yeah. um, instructions. And in fact, the finest pen that I had at home that I could use without it smudging or anything, I find with biros and things like that, that you can well, smudge them. Gloopy, don't they? Yes, so um, I use my friction pen, but oh, make sure that you're not going to actually iron your um, tracing. I've never used it on tracing paper. Yes, it's lovely, oh, okay. it's lovely. So you draw around and um, draw around the template. The important parts to include your centre and your end of scene mark here. Mm. And then for the actual design, all I did was just some straight lines. So so, and straight lines and dots like that. Okay. So, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, trace it off. So trace it off. Then you can use it again. Yes. And um, the reason <coughs> why you trace it off is transferring that, you know, I was thinking, right, okay, I'll use a light box. You can use a light box. Um, but the linen um, is a little bit thicker and also... Um, with this particular purse, because the linen's got a lovely sort of feel to it, um, we actually, I add, actually use some of the lightweight interfacing right. just to give it a bit more body. So when you're stitching it, it the, the fabric sort of got a little bit more, okay. it's, it's firmer. Um, so you will um, cut your pieces out, cut your lining out, cut your um, the interfacing out. Um, it's an iron-on interfacing, so you iron that onto the fabric. And then it was like, right, OK, how do I get that onto the fabric? So what I did was I actually used, and I don't know whether it's the right thing, but it worked for me. Um, I used either my ironing board or a pad, um, a towel or something like that. And I actually popped the fabric underneath. And you're going to be marking it on the um, right side. So I'm just going to turn that over. And you will not be able to see this very clearly. Um, I don't know how close we can get in. Um, but I popped that over the top. Look at that. Close. OK. I'm, I'll do it on one that so I haven't done. The code that's on the screen at the moment is for the tailors all. Because... Because so that's, that's what Carl's going to be using. So there's my pattern over the top. Mm. And then I used the tailors all and I actually pierced... Okay. the um, tracing paper and made a hole okay so you pierce and for the little um, stars at the side which we've used the metallic the light effects thread um, I just did a, a hole in the center and then I took my friction pen and I actually Ooh. marked right. the fabric yeah. through so um, I think I've marked all of this one uh -huh. so could you use like a pin instead would that be you a could, but the pin doesn't make, make make a big. You need like a quick, a quick, a thick needle, right, to make a hole. Because if you just use a pin, you haven't really made a hole Not in a the bigger. tracing so paper. So a thick needle, or ideally a tailor's awl. But if, if you you've got, got a tailor's awl, if you haven't, then um, you know a, ni a nice thick um, needle or something to make the hole, so that you can actually pop your um, light, uh, your friction pen through, and make these little dots. And then that's your pattern. Oh, okay. So if you can see yeah, that I there, see that. okay. So that's Perfect. how you transfer it. And then what I want to do well, that's is that's a really show good method to use for other things as well. It is. It? it really is. And there's one that I've done before, and I've started the stitching. So um, I'm going to whiz on with some stitching. Um, and for this one, because it's lovely and natural and neutral. I thought the... Um, That's the stone colourway. Yeah. The Sashko thread would work really, really well with this. Let me get the... Oh, the cream. The, is that the yeah. cream? Oh, okay, the cream one. The cream with the gold. I love natural sort of things. Yes, um, I do. It works things. beautifully. So you've got your um, light effects thread there. 
and then you've got your sashko thread for this particular one i didn't actually put any beads on it okay so i used french knots which i think is just yeah, as effective you can. it's up, up to you isn't it you don't have yes. to put beads yeah and also once you've got this technique sorted you can make whatever design you like mm. you know if you wanted to you could cover the whole of this with just the snowflakes or you could cover the whole of it with the star yeah. or you could do the combination of the two on the front of the bag and then on the back of the bag do the alternative or keep it plain i kept yeah. mine and the sample that you've got there is just plain on the back yes but if you wanted to you could you know play around with um how you're going to do that so um to do some uh hand stitching because you've got the interfacing on the wrong side, and I, in fact, when I um, put the friction pen on the front, I've, I noticed it, it, it came through to the back as well. Oh, handy. Which is quite handy. <laughs> um, you have got to look very carefully where it is. Um, but for example, I'm going to do this snowflake here. You've got the interfacing there. So in, instead of um, tying a knot in the end of your thread, I just actually ran my thread through the interfacing. So between the interfacing oh, and the fabric, okay. you might find, don't pull it too tight um, because you don't want the interfacing to um, rip. And then I just did another little stitch there. And then you come through to the right side. And again, I hope you'll be able to see that. So that's through one of the dots that I've already made for the center of the snowflake. And then just pull your thread through. Just be very careful when you do your, do your first stitch that you don't pull it all the way through. You can tell that I've already done that before. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So you pull that through, make sure that it's nice and secure on the back. And then you do a long stitch. Okay. And it is just a long stitch. So with the Sashko thread, you're using the thread as it is. With the stranded cotton, I thought, hmm, I don't think I want to actually strand this down. And what you would normally do with stranded cotton is take a strand off at a time and then lay them back together. Sorry, I'm going to jump around a bit. So I've done my long stitch there and I'm going to do a French knot here. So I'm going to wrap that round three times. So going back to the stranded cotton, I actually wanted to use all six strands. And because it's a straight stitch like this, I didn't strand it. I left it just so it was twisted, so it gave a smoother stitch. So if you look at the um, detail on the purse that I've done, that was with stranded cotton. Yeah. And um, I didn't want it to be flat. I wanted it to be twisted. So so that's your first stitch and your first French knot. So, so it go, really is very simple embroidery, isn't my it? My gosh, yes. Very, very simple. But then they, that's the way that their, the Zaka projects work, isn't it? They're always quite simple but really beautiful. It is. And you can make it as um, detailed as you like or as simple as you like. Um, but it is just a straight stitch with a French knot. And then I'll show you how to do the little stars as well. And I guess the beads are ideal, so for people who don't want to do for, don't want to do French knots, they just use a bead. Yes, yeah, you can use a bead, you can use a sequin, which is quite nice. Um, you know, you can play around with what you've got, you know. Um, I didn't have any sequins that were um, mm. this sort of colour, so I thought, oh, I'll just use French knots. So pull that through. And on the back, you'll see that my stitches are going like that, so I'm not mm. starting and stopping. I'm actually making sure that the um, thread goes all the way through. Right. And I just found that that was easier to make sure that the stitch laid nice and flat. So another stitch there. So as I say, you can see on the back, we've got these long stitches on the back. Just don't want to pull them too tight. But I guess the interfacing does help prevent it that. It really does. It really does. And then just another French knot there. So you can see how quick Yeah, very, it is. very quick project to do, isn't it? And as I say, you can make it, you know, a little bit more detailed. You can add, you know, customise it really, or just follow the instructions that are included in the pack. And I love this Sashko thread. Um, I think in the instructions they suggested a pearl thread. You can use a pearl thread if you've got pearl thread yeah. at home. Um, but if not, this Sashko thread's a lovely thickness 
And I love the fact that this is a natural linen and you've got the cotton thread. And it's also so matte, isn't it? As yes, well? this particular one is, yes. Which is lovely. Let me see what it says about the embroidery. They didn't actually give much in instructions on the embroidery. Um, yeah, one strand of pearl cotton, that's all it says. Yeah. But as I say, you can play around with it as you wish. OK, I'll do a final French knot and then I'll show you how to do the gold and then we'll get on to the assembly. I think that's the, the thing that is a bit daunting for people who've never done it before. I like the fact in, in this one they've used they've used a natural linen one, but they've used a velvet for the other one as well. Yes. They are lovely projects, they mm. really are. And, um, you know, even the simple, I think you've got a coin purse one there. And yes, we have got the kit for that. But this is sort of thing, if you saw this in one of the accessory shops on the high street, it would cost a lot of money. It would it? do, it would do. And the beads would fall off <laughs> halfway through the evening. Okay, so that's um, the snowflake. Mm, so to okay. do the um, gold, this is the little star here. Um, oh, those are just sort of dotted around it, aren't they? They are, and they were just the dots. Do you remember we just yes, did dots yeah. um, for those? So I'll get... Right, I took a single strand of the um, metallic thread and then put the two raw ends together and I threaded that through the eye of the needle. I'm not, I wasn't going to do this live on air because we'd still be here at 12 <laughs> o'clock. Um, but you will thread that through and then you do a little slip knot in your needle and that stops the thread from moving and it just makes it much much easier mm. and you're working with two strands then so you've right. got the double end there thread it through your needle do a little slip knot around the eye of the needle and that's nice and secure and it won't come off and the beauty about light effects is a lot of metallic threads don't give this nice smooth thread yes i guess a lot of most metallic threads they're quite rough aren't they they which are which does make them very shiny and very metallic they are but it's just what you're getting used to so again to start i just do a couple of little stitches on the back you can leave quite a long end here because you're going to snip that off do a little back stitch and then come through to the right side now you can make these stars as big as you like i'm going to make this one a little bit bigger so that you can see and I'm going from, I don't know, about half a centimetre from the dot. And then I, this is the way I did. You can either go across and then cross it with long, long stitches. But I found it easier to actually go down into the centre. And even with the slip knot on the needle, you can see how easily this passes through this linen fabric. Yeah. I guess because the fabric is, is quite an open weave. It is, and also the um, interfacing is just a lightweight one, yeah. so the um, okay. it's very forgiving. So you do six of these, and as I say, just down in the centre, like that. And again, you can see how quickly this mm. grows. Yeah, so you could just put just a few or I think if it was me, I always get a bit carried away. I'm not very good at less is more. I'd have <laughs> a, the whole thing would end up being, I'll just have one more there. I know, I'll just, just add them all over the place. There. Well, they're so quick to do, aren't they? They are. They add a little bit of sparkle. They're so effective. And you can see, actually, mine, there's different lengths and everything. But don't worry about it. This is a handmade purse. This is a yes. handmade design. But that looks so effective there. It's beautiful. When you see really the light like shining that. on it. It's really lovely. And then on the back, I'm going to snip off the raw edges of that thread that we started with and then just do a couple of little you can do like a slip knot just to secure the thread on the back like Perfect. that and then just snip that okay so that's how you do your stitching. I hope that's um, sort of Yeah, helped. no, that's really lovely. So, um, but I know I said if you want to alter it at all, you've got the template there, you could trace over it and then draw a leather pattern. Or if you wanted to put initials on the other side. You can just play around with it. And um, initially I thought, oh, do I need to actually mark it onto the fabric, put it in a hoop? and mm. you know, do that and then cut it out. And I actually found, you know, I've handled this quite a bit, but because it's got the interfacing, the linen right. isn't fraying. So, um, you know, it really is very, oh, it's a lovely mm. um, fabric. I've used this on um, some soft toys. I think there was a teddy bear 
and um, it's it's just beautiful it just stretches nicely so okay so that's how you do your transferring your design and your stitching perfect so what we want to do then is move on to the assembly so what yeah now this is the bit that's yeah that can be a bit scary so you can see i've got the marks there and what we're going to do is a quarter of an inch from there we're going to machine all okay. the way around and that that's curve. all marked on the pattern it isn't is it? and the is instructions really are very very clear but what i suggest to make it easier is just come a couple of stitches below that mark and that's where you're going to actually okay. start and finish so just two machine stitches yeah and um do a reverse stitch there as well so i'm going that, to do then? that and um, just to when you're putting the actual clasp in the clasp is going to sit here and you're going to have a piece of lining that you're going to machine in exactly the same way. So you just want a little bit extra. A little bit of extra yeah. give. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's pop that over there. And so just a couple of stitches away from that mark. You know, it doesn't have to be completely accurate, but it does just help. And then what we'll do is we'll do a couple of stitches forward, then reverse couple of stitches back and then just follow the curve round about a quarter of an inch from the edge and again because you've got the interfacing there the the fabric sits really nicely on the machine and smooth and I would choose a thread that's very similar to the um, color of your okay. fabric um, just because it makes a more professional finish to it. So we'll come back round again just to the mark. I'm going to do a couple of stitches away, go in reverse and a couple of stitches forward. I love this machine because I love the um, automatic cutter. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's the little things. It is the it? little things. Yes. So I've got one at home that doesn't have an automatic well, cutter. Well, don't forget, I'm thinking, it's 10% off machines. I know, I can't believe Which it. It's amazing, isn't it? And it's just wonderful that you've still got the machines and everything. So, um, Well, I know there's good. so many places that have sold out, so particularly Christmas, and everyone's saying, oh, can you still get hold of things? I, I know I see on the news the other day because I haven't. I've, probably only done about half my Christmas shopping so you can't get things so if you want to buy a sewing machine for Christmas we still do have our sewing machines mm -hmm. in stock and 10% off just saying <laughs> just saying have a look on the website have a word with Santa because mm. that's fine you know it's there are a lot of items like that well I mean sewing machines have flown out since lockdown haven't I they? know I know um, so if you're thinking about treating yourself or someone else to a machine this Christmas 10% off Okay, so once you've done your quarter of an inch, um, you can either snip um, with just normal scissors or use pinking shears. I love my pinking shears for going around curves. Um, it just helps enormously. And again... Oh, I love pinking shears. It's like the much better than all of that oh, overlocking, yes. isn't it? So again, um, the, the linen isn't fraying, so... Um, so you only do the bit that you've sewn? The curved bit, okay. And then you'll do exactly the same with the lining, and then we'll turn the lining right sides out then you want to um i'm just looking at the time oh we're okay i was going to say i'll just press the line so you just again i pinked the um curves on the lining but you can just roll it can't you just to make sure that that's seen you could use if you wanted to keep the um fat quarter of plain for yourself you could use a really pretty line oh couldn't you? my gosh can you imagine well you know when you have all those small oh. scraps or you know you've bought some charm packs and you think oh i love that fabric don't know what to Chula do with pink it. or all, yes, oh cute. my gosh or liberty liberty would look would be beautiful, beautiful in the lining wouldn't it yes. and then you can keep your fat quarter yeah oh in the next hour just saying liberty fabric reduced mm. Mm. plus 10 percent <laughs> yeah just saying okay so then you pop your lining right sides together into the actual purse and then you're going to be matching these edges. So it's right edges. sides together. Right sides together. And at this stage, I would actually pin this um, just because when you come to the 
part where the clasp is going to go, you want to be able to actually machine that right across. Or you can um, do it in stages. So it's entirely up to you. So you're just pinning them right pinning sides them together. Right sides together, the raw edges together. Okay. Like that. So you've done all your embroidery before now. And what you will need to do is leave a gap. So you're going to leave a gap on one of the sides. Okay. And this is the thing that you'll want to take a bit of time with. So we want to leave a gap for turning. But you leave it on that sort of straight edge. Yeah, leave it on the straight edge. And what I'm going to do is actually machine, and I'm going to machine all the way down. And I, again, found it easier to stop there and then start again on the other side. So that's okay. what I'm going to do. Um, so you don't sew across? You can, um, but I just found it easier to okay. make a nice, neat edge. So you'll do your reverse stitch at the beginning. And do your quarter of an inch. Just when you get to the corner, you don't want necessarily a sharp corner. I'm going to take my pin out as well. Um, you can just take your time when you get there. So when we get down to the bottom here, I'm going to machine as close as I can, but again, you can leave just a couple of stitches away from that mark and then do your reverse. We're going to do that all the way round. As I say, remembering to leave the gap. So the sewing machine that um, Car is using at the moment is the Elna 570A. So the price of this is £639. Um, so, and we had to put the prices of the machine up recently because Elmer put their prices up. But because you get your 10% off today, that takes it below the lower price that we had it before, if you see what I mean. So you will save £63.90 on this machine today. Now remember that it will be split across three equal... Is it four? Four! Right, so this is over four split payments. So this was put onto a special deal. So if you want to split it, you don't have to. You can pay for it all in one go. Get your ten percent off. That's up to you. But if you, but if you want to split it, and don't worry, you will still get the ten percent off the split pay. Then you have four equal payments: one hundred fifty-nine pounds and seventy-five pence. That will be that's zero percent interest. So you don't get charged any extra for doing that. It just means if you want to spread the payments, it's an easy way of doing it. The machine will be sent to you straight away. You haven't got to wait to pay all of them, but you can pay it off in four equal chunks. So if you use your code today, it five hundred and seventy-five pounds and ten pence. This is the beautiful Elna E five seventy eight, which is a lovely machine. And we used to sell it at 599. Then they'd put the prices up. But so with your 10% off code, that takes it down below the price that it used to be. And that is only till midnight. After midnight, that's the end of our 10%. They will all go back up. We were only allowed to do it for one extra day. So if you are thinking about a buying machine, this is kind of your mid-level machine, Cara? Yes. Uh, it's wonderful for starting. Um, I think because it's got so many different... Um, I think it comes with the different, um, some of the different feet and different stitches and things like that. It's got um, the card at the side mm. with the different and it cuts setup. the thread. Yes, and it cuts. The we thread. love that. Yeah, we love the definitely thread love that. Bit. So I'm just, I've done my quarter of an inch all the way round. You will take a, a little bit more care than I have just done, <laughs> um, but I'm wanting to try and get onto the glue part. So. We've machined all the way round. I've just snipped the corners and I bet that's not going to be very big. So I'm going to actually just snip that a little bit more to turn it. 
but that bit will be hidden inside the clasp. It will it? be, yes. So don't worry too much. It's just I was getting a bit carried away. <laughs> Right, that's better. Got a bit more space now. So now we're going to turn it all the way through. And you'll press it, then we're going to top stitch and then we're going to actually glue. So what I'm going to do is get started on the gluing and let the glue go off right. a little bit before we actually insert the purse into the um, clasp if we're all right time wise Are yeah we, okay? we got another 10 minutes excellent so i've turned that all the way through and i'm going to press it so before i do that i'm going to i am um, like making sure that i protect whatever i'm working on with glue with glue because i'm i get glue so we have everywhere. got the textile glue you will need glue to put this in but we do have exactly the right glue for you to use but we are very low in stock, so if you want some, put it in your basket. It's four ninety nine. It's textile glue, absolutely perfect for this. But you can also use it for all other textiles too. You can use it for leather, which is quite useful. Should you need to use use leather or PU, but it is perfect. Oh, it's now sold out. <laughs> it's very very busy, very busy because ten percent ten percent off everything. Right. So you open your clasp. Okay. Mm. And your clasp will only go that far, okay? Okay. So you know that that's the part of the purse right. that you want to, um, that will close. So you'll take your um, glue. I've got a slightly different glue to you, but um, this is one that I had at home. And um, it really does help when it's got a nozzle on the end. And what you're going to do, I'm just going to wipe that bit off. As I say, I get this everywhere. So um, you want to pop your glue into the channel. So um, you see there's a channel here. And you're going to just squeeze a bit of the glue. I should have had mine upside down. And you want a glue that's going to um, stick fabric to metal. So um, there are lots available from different stores. Um, there's a lovely big store that does lots of crafts that um, I got this one from. So if you are struggling to get glue, that's where you can get that from. So I've done um, a bit of a channel, I think, hoping you can see that. Yes, yeah, so you just squeeze into the channel all around. Yeah. And then that's quite chunky at the moment. Um, so I'm going to... Use a cocktail stick or something like that, and you're going to spread that so that it's going on both sides of the frame and that you're getting rid of the excess. Yeah, because I guess you don't want it showing on the fabric. You don't want it to show, but don't worry if, you know, you do get glue coming through um, because it dries nice and clear and then it can be picked off. So, But what you want to do is make sure that you're getting glue on both sides of that. OK, we might only get a chance to do one side, but it's exactly the same technique for both. So I'm going to leave that to dry a bit. Pop my Remember to put your cover on the nozzle and pop that out of the way so they don't get to on the other fabric. And then I'm just going to turn this. I haven't got a turning tool. Oh, there's a very pokey that? thing. Oh, I'll just use one of those. <laughs> um, might not need it. It's just, it's nice to get a smoother edge. And do you remember where I said, you know, about um, leaving a couple of stitches? Mm. Don't know if you can get in close on this. That's where the actual join is. And you can see, actually, even though I've done this quite quickly, that's come together nicely. Yes, so there's a right. little bit more space there for um, inserting the clasp. So turning this round, I'm going to press. Oh, 
and you've got your opening where you're turning, so that needs sorting. Just go into the corners. Um, you want to try and reduce the amount of bulk that's going to go into the frame. Um, so we we trimmed when we did the pinking shears. There's not a lot of fabric there, but where you get to those corners, you want those corners to be pushed out quite nicely so you haven't got excess fabric. Pop the lining down into the bag and we'll come through onto the other side and just poke that one through. Like that. And we're going to press that and then we're going to top stitch. And that really does sort of give you a nice flat surface in which to put your clasp. Yeah, so I guess the, it's all about the preparation, isn't it? It's making it you push the corners out and you top yes. stitch it and press it yes. so that it's nice and flat and even. Exactly. Um, but the top stitching helps. Um, but just take your time doing this. Um, it's worth it in the end. And then we've got, right, I'm going to lose my pattern that I've transferred because I've got um, <laughs> yeah. my friction pen there. So we'll just press that. And what you're going to do is machine and top stitch all the way around. And as I say, the instructions are very, very clear. I'll show you on the instructions. So we've got to um, this part here on the instructions. Yeah, there they are. And it's well, it's nice that every bit of the instructions, they've got some really nice, very um, clear, diagrams. clear diagrams yes. to see how to do it as well. Yes. Just going to press that in a little bit more because we're going to be um, closing the turning gap when we top stitch. Okay, so. And whilst we're doing this, that glue's starting to get quite tacky, which okay. is nice. So um, increase your stitch length um, to about a three is good. And I like doing my top stitching from the front because that's the part that's, well, this part's going to be actually in the clasp, but um, that would be the part that would normally be showing. And you want to um, top stitch as close to the edge as possible. And come down. And the, all this preparation is, is helping you to get ready to put um, the fabric into the channel that you've put the glue in. I've stopped where the, um, the, the um, hinge of the clasp is going to be. Oh, right, so that you don't... Just, again, it's the, the bulk and everything. Yeah. You don't want too much. Hi, Rebecca and Cara. Lovely demo. Can you tell me the code for the 10% off? I can. It's Best Friend 2021. BF 2021. It's actually stands for Black Friday. <laughs> but I think it could be best friend. Definitely. Best friend. We're your best friend because we're going to ten percent off two days in a row. BF twenty twenty one. Right. I don't know if you want to um, recap anything while I'm. Right. You just yeah. say with me. <laughs> I will. <Sorry>. Yes. <laughs> I'm just. Uh, people don't want to see me doing this bit. <laughs> we love watching you sewing. Oh, Laura. I love. I love sewing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we love watching you sew, but we will recap the kit. <laughs> so the car, the kit, the car, the kit, the kit, the car is working with at the moment is the teal one. So, oh, working, sorry, not this one. The one that she's working with, not the one she's made already, is the stone one. So in the kit, you get full instructions. You get the clasp, you get the rope string that goes inside to hold it in place and the chain. Um, sorry. You also get a fat 
quarter of this beautiful stone coloured linen fabric that's used for the outside. There's enough here for three purses. Obviously you only get one clasp, but it just shows you how much fabric there is because there's enough there for three, because it's very wide, but you still get a fat quarter. And you get a fat quarter of the cream fabric that you can use for the lining. So that is the stone one that Cara is doing. Now, if you would like to make the, um, the one that Cara has made as a demonstration, the aqua version, which is most popular, you get obviously full instructions, you get the clasp, the chain and the string, you get a fat quarter of the aqua linen and you get a fat quarter of the pale blue cotton fabric that you use for the lining. If, however, you charcoal is something that you fancy, um, in the pewter pack you get obviously the instructions and the, all the bits and pieces. You get a fat quarter of this lovely pewter coloured linen fabric, really lovely linen texture to this one. And you get a fat quarter of the pale grey, which is used to line it. And then the final choice, if you want to accessorise with blue, if you want this to match your blue outfit, then you this one is called denim. You get the um, the pack with the instructions and all the hardware. You get the fat quarter of this lovely denim blue coloured fabric and a fat quarter of the royal blue that is used to line the purse. So you've just got to choose. Stone, aqua, pewter or denim. Okay. Are we ready? Yeah, I'm ready. So okay. the glue's been um, sort of going off slightly, so it should be a little bit tackier than it was when I first put it in. Mm. Um, you want the string cord that you have in the pack, and you want to cut that roughly the um, length of the long side there and the two short sides there. So you want two long strips and four short strips. Make sure that you're going to be putting the purse in the right way. So that's the way the purse is closing so I know I want the right side upwards so I'm going to place let me just so I want that bit in there so I'm going to be placing this part of the purse and this is where you know you think oh my gosh it's not going to go it's not going to go and you can just slide that into that channel there and down the sides. And if you want to, you could use um, the Wonder Clips to hold it oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Um, in place. But can you see how easily yeah. that's gone and in? And it goes in really deeply as well. Okay. Um, so you've actually popped that in there. You will turn it over and you can use, now uh, this is where you have to raid somebody's toolbox. So um, I've actually, this is a really, really, really old screwdriver, um, but you can also use the awl to p make sure that this is popped into the channel. And you want to push that fabric right up into uh, the channel. Okay, from the inside. Okay, from the inside. Um, then you can unwrap the paper cord slightly which makes it a bit thicker. And then you'll pop that into the, ch the channel there. And you can either use the awl or you can use, I've got a really old screwdriver here. And you can see from the amount of glue that I've got on it that I've used it quite a few times, but you pop that paper in and that just helps make the bag nice and secure. If you've got um, excess of the cord there, you can just trim that off and poke that in. Okay, so we'll just pop that all the way around there just to make it nice and secure. And then you do the side pieces exactly the same way. Unravel it slightly to make a larger surface area. And then you pop that in there. And this just helps keep your bag nice and secure. And then you, the, the worst thing is now you've got to leave that to dry. So you need to go off, make a cup of tea, right. do whatever you fancy and just pop that one in there. 
So that just helps to, is it, is it to sort of fill the gap? Yes, it just um, makes it more secure. And then that's what it looks like on the right side. Beautiful. And then you have to wait for that to dry. You have to wait for that to dry. The other thing that you can do is use um, a bit of um, wadding, cover that, and then I don't know what these are called. What are these called? I don't know. Pliers. And you can actually squeeze oh, pliers, right, by the, um, yes. right by the hinge. Mm. And then that, again, just keeps that nice and secure. Uh, okay. And if there's any glue that comes off, it comes off very easily. Right. OK. That's lovely. All right. Thank you so much. That's, That's really right. I mean, obviously, you know, you when you do something live on air like that, it, it's worked beautifully. So it can't be too difficult. No. And, you know, I, I apologise, you know, that I've rushed through, but I wanted to cover as no, much as I could. No, you have done. It's lovely. Thank so, you so much right. for that. They're gorgeous. Right, well, we will see you back in another hour. I know. With for Gnome, for the Gnome extravaganza. I know, I know. Can't wait. <laughs> OK, <laughs> thanks, Cara. So, we won't... I'm not going to go through the kits again because we've got... If you want to buy the instructions on their own, which comes instructions, and obviously with the instructions, you get one class purse, the chain and the string. They're $14.99 if you want to use your own fabric, which you can because the template is in there, but that's obviously you only get the one clasp with that, but you have got full instructions if you want. That's a lovely little kit for somebody for Christmas. We have another couple of kits um, also by Zaka Workshop. We've got the classic coin purse. So that's that really lovely little thing. That's beautiful. And again, you get the instructions, the clasp and the string. So this is perfect for using um, you know, your own special little piece of fabric, or if you want to give someone a personalised purse, make one from velvet. That's the um, coin purse. We have the vintage class purse. So this one's similar, but obviously just a, a wider than the other one. I love the, I the ideas that they've given you, the little buttons and the sorts of fabric. And again, all the instructions you need for doing this. And it comes complete with an inner pocket as well, so you can put your credit cards in. So that's very nice, isn't it? Twelve ninety nine for the vintage clasp wallet kit, and everything it tells you everything you need to know. But I like the fact it has the little um, pocket inside, so that's all you'll need for the vintage clasp wallet. Obviously, you need to provide your own fabric. Now, talking about hand stitching and embroidery, we have a very special bundle for you as well. So this is. A Sashko bundle. So if you love Sashko, if you manage to buy the book in the hour before, for $29.98, you get two Sashko thread packs, which gives you 20 20 metre skeins in total. Look at that, all of those different colours, all the beautiful traditional Sashko thread. But remember, it's Black Tag Day. So the price is reducing from 29.98 to 22.98. So if you love Sashko, you want to get involved, you want to build your stash and have all different colored threads, 22.98, and don't forget, you will get 10% off that as well if you use the BF2021 code. You'll, never, you'll get another £2.29 off that. That's a fantastic price, isn't it? 20 20 meter skeins of beautiful Sashko thread. Anyway, um, thank you for joining me this hour. It's been wonderful, hasn't it? I've really enjoyed learning exactly step by step how to put the class purse together. It gives me the confidence to do it properly myself now. Um, I'll be back with you in a couple of minutes time for even more fantastic black tag deals. All again with the 10% um, code. If you've looked on the website, those, those are the full prices on there. As I go through each of the products, you'll be able to find out what we're cutting the price to. I'll see you back in a couple of minutes. If you'd like to get in touch with us during our live show and send in any messages or any questions, then you can do it on studio at sewingstreet.com. Alternatively, you can message us on our official Facebook page. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere 
Browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals. And message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. Hi guys, I'm Becky Alexander Frost and I own a pattern brand called RJF Makes. RJF Makes is my initials which is Rebecca Jane Alexander Frost and most of you might know me as Baffa in the studio when John and Vic say our Baffa when I message in. Favourite thing to make? I think people know me by now. I like to make bags as you can see I've got a few bags behind me. Um, most of my patterns are bags, um, however there is a few craft style patterns available as well. Claim to fame, I used to previously be on another sewing channel <laughs> with John and Vix and the team, <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> and um, basically I used to work alongside some famous um, pattern designers testing for them. What got me into sewing was my mom. Um, when I was five, I was um, standing next to her while she was sewing some bridesmaids dresses for me and my sister. And basically I asked if I could um, learn to sew. She said I was a bit immature, still immature by the way. Um, she said I'm a bit young to learn her words and basically she said maybe when you're a bit older so my when I turned eight I basically learned to hand sew and by the age of 11 I had my first sewing machine I'm now in my late 30s but still act that eight year old my favorite tools or top tips so I have two best friends one's called the bulky sea maid which is this and one is called quilter steak this will help anybody, the bulky sea maid will help anybody if you've um, got something bulky going underneath your presser foot. This will stop any stitches from jumping and basically missing a stitch. Now this is my best friend for when I would come to put in zips and you'll see me use this a lot, I mean a lot. Thank you ever so much and I'll see you all soon, bye. We know that shopping online can be a confusing and sometimes daunting task, and sometimes all you want to do is talk to a human being. Well, our family-run customer service team are on call 24-7. They're full of friendly, warm-hearted individuals, all trained to make your shopping experience as easy and as enjoyable as possible. And not only will they take your order, they will also help and guide you on your shopping journey, so you never miss out. of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there. If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. And welcome back to Sewing Street for our second black tag hour. I have got a beautiful shop here. Look at the look at this stack. Stack of Liberty. There. Look at that. But we're just taking out for now to concentrate. Christmas Liberty. What could be better? 
Oh, I love these because obviously Liberty is traditional, it's timeless, it's classic. Same as Christmas, really, isn't it? Comes back, comes out all the time. Classic and timeless. Right, let me move the main bundle out of the day. So these Christmas Liberty fabrics, they are beautiful, aren't they? Obviously, special offer now. Let's have a look at the first one. Loving the baubles. Loving the baubles. Look at these. Now, this is in two colourways. So this is from the Liberty Merry and Bright fabric range. This is the navy, midnight, midnight blue colourway. Look at those, it's gorgeous. Now this normally is £7.49 pence because it's Liberty for half a metre. Now this isn't your Liberty lawn. I know that's in the traditionally Liberty was nearly always lawn fabric. If you haven't seen this before, this is quilting weight cotton, but it's its Liberty print. So you could use it for all your normal quilting, homeware and dressmaking needs, but it's quilting weight cotton, but it's Liberty. Now this is sold by the half metre. So, obviously, if you want more than half a metre, if you've got an idea that you want to make something that you need more fabric than this, then we will cut it to order. So if you need a metre and a half, put three units in your basket. You won't be sent three half metres. You'll be set it as a complete one and a half metre piece. Um, however, it's Black Tag Day, isn't it? It's Black Tag Day. So it isn't going to be £7.49. And don't forget, it's 10%. 10% off everything today um, before we crash the price so you have everything that's on the website everything that I'm talking to you today everything the only thing so and sewing machines too the only thing that we don't have the 10% off is gift vouchers but everything else so any of the deals that we have so any of the black tag deals any of the clearance offers the sales items it's 10% off those prices too so sometimes we have special deals where um, it's only 10% off things that aren't in clearance or things that haven't been reduced already. But with this special, we have, if you, you, we had 10% off yesterday, we had the same code BF2021, massively popular. So we decided, well, those in charge decided that we would have another 10% off day today. Um, so they let, so we decided we'd do it again today. This is our last 10% off day, but it really is off our very thing. Now, this Liberty fabric is normally, normally £7.49. But you won't pay that. You will pay today £5.99. There's something happened with the graphic that won't let us change that price down. But it will be. When you buy it, it will come out of your basket. It is £5.99 for half a metre. Liberty print fabric beautiful Christmas baubles, lovely midnight background with really bright shades of reds and blues and with the cream. They look like those sort of hand glow um, glass baubles, but always vintage as well, which is exactly what Liberty is. But this will be 5 99 for half a metre. Plus, remember, you'll get 10% off that too, so you'll get another 59 pence off there. Now that's the navy blue one. We also have the same fabric in red. But it's lovely, I mean it's Liberty red, isn't it? It's not bright scarlet pillar blocks red. It's a more muted red. It's beautiful, isn't it? Again, this one will be reduced to 5.99. But for some reason the graphics aren't working. But I honestly, you will be only charged that. But don't the two of them don't they go together? Look at that. Don't they go together beautifully? Lovely mixture. Liberty Fabric, 5 99 Never seen it before. Well, and 10% off. Another 59%, 59 pence off that. Right, we've also got some panels. We're just going to check what's happening with the, well, so we can get you the right graphics on to make it a bit easier. Then we'll come back to those. Let's have a look at the Santa panels. We try, I've got three of them. Let's start with this one. Santa's little, little smiley face is looking at me. Let me unfold him. 
This is Tractor Santa. Can we see the whole thing? Isn't he lovely? So in the background, it's all black and white. So you've got the black and white house in the snow. And then you've got Santa on his tractor. Well, I don't think he's on a tractor. Santa's on a sleigh, isn't he? Can I put it up so you can see a bit more of him? Really lovely panel. It's cut as one piece, makes a beautiful wall hanging for Christmas, doesn't he? So you've got Santa on the farm with his present and the tractor, he's got a wreath on the front of him. I like the way all of the background is all sort of neutral black and white tones. And then he's bright red in front of it. Here comes Santa. So this panel, $8.99. I mean, this makes, you know, when, if you, when you're putting up your Christmas decorations, hang this one up as well. Or make an extra large, super large stocking. So maybe you've got a really big present for somebody or you want to make somebody a new stocking. And you know what it's like? I mean, when I made my children's stock, their little stockings can never get all the presents in them. I can never get them in because they, they should be bigger. But this makes a really big, if you just use a piece of um, plain fabric for the back, what a lovely big sack. And um, just put a drawstring top on it. Gorgeous. So that one is reduced to... $8.99. And remember, 10% off. Use your BF2021. Right, I've got another Santa panel. This looks like a birdhouse. This one's really sweet. This one is being reduced to eight ninety nine as well. So this is Santa with his forest friends, with the bird, he's with the birdhouse. He's got a fox, rabbits, deer. Isn't that lovely? Again, wall hanging, sack, cover table covering, quilt, cock quilt, small lap quilt. You could just um, have it draped over the back of the sofa, actually. It's lovely, isn't it? Anyway, eight ninety nine. That's a fantastic reduction, isn't it? Right, one more Santa panel. Oh, look, I like that one. That shh, shh, Santa. So there's Santa. I'm trying to see if I can get, show you a bit better on the table. There we go. Santa with his sack filled with teddies and presents. Shh. That's lovely, isn't it? Shh. So this one, full price, is thirteen ninety nine. But this one will be reduced to $8.99. Uh, I can't, for some reason, we can't get the price. We can't get that on the screen. But it will be $8.99. Don't worry, $8.99 for the, si what does it say? Santa's night out. <laughs> he only gets one a year. <laughs> I mean, he's like, I can't wait till Christmas Eve. It's the only night out I get. Santa's night out. It's lovely, isn't it? Anyway, get it now because, if, you know, you will be able to, you, you can use it for things for this Christmas, obviously, because there's still several weeks to go, but it's really worth getting hold of now if you wanted to use it to make something special. You could even use any of those panels for the centre of um, a quilt if you put Christmas fabrics around the edges of it. Right, let's go through our Liberty bundle. I told you I had a big stack. A big stack of, this is not Christmas Liberty, this is just normal Liberty, but it is all quilting weight cotton. I have got a big stack of them here. Let's go one by one. Um, this one is CZYV27. Beautiful primrose yellow colour with little white um, flowers all over it. Very, very pretty, pretty, absolutely beautiful Liberty fabric, but obviously it's Black Tag Day, 5 99 for half a metre. Again, this is half metre fabric. 
so if you want to buy more than half a meter that's what it looks like if you want to buy more than half a meter you can just put that number of units in your basket it will be sent it will be sent as one whole cut piece there you go look just to prove it is real liberty fabric but quilting weight cotton this is a fantastic price and remember for today and today only well it's 5.99 for a start with but you also get your 10 percent off the black tag will disappear and the 10 percent will disappear tomorrow right number two. Oh, this is not oh this is very liberty look at the colors in this very very do you need the code BAYV61, isn't that pretty? You've got a really lovely, strong blue background. You've got midnight blue, sapphire blue, and a pale blue. These beautiful, like, chrysanthemum-type flowers in reds and pinks. That's gorgeous. There are only seven metres of this left. We're not going to get any more of this. But it's fine. It's 5 99 for half a metre. That is a fantastic price, isn't it? A bee, um, we've, look, there we go. This is Car Carnation Carnival. We haven't offered it at this price before. This is just our special gift to you for, uh, there's only three metres left of this. And when it's gone, it's gone. Um, oh, this is lovely. Look at this striped one. This is FSYV42. Quarter of this stock actually went on pre-order. The um, stripes run parallel to the salvage, so you know which way they go. Beautiful little rows of flowers, all different sizes, but aren't the colours lovely? I mean, they're just Liberty, aren't they? Just beautiful Liberty colours. This really is a great time to get ahead, get your stash built. If you've got something in mind that you want to make or you just love the fabric at $5.99 plus the 10% discount, this is an offer that we won't be repeating. Classic gorgeousness. Oh, now this is just, this is your very, very traditional, quintessential Liberty from the Carnaby collection. Look at the side, the, um, the size of the print. It's RZYV96. Beautiful, I mean, it just is what Liberty does beautifully, doesn't it? These very small, tiny little all over floral prints totally multi-directional pajama bottoms pajama bottoms red t-shirt lovely but 5.99 for half a meter now you need about two and a half meter two meters for make a pair of pajama bottoms gorgeous aren't they little girls dresses makeup bags cushions for the spare bedroom so many things you can make that nice little a-line summer skirt Five ninety nine for half a meter plus the ten percent discount. Next, that one will sell out. Now, you know, if you want to have a look, if you think, well, I like the red and the blue, and you've shown me four, four, I'm not sure which, just pop onto the website quickly, click on Watch Live, scroll down, you'll see pictures of all of them, and then you can quickly choose. However, RGYV eighty two from the Carnaby collection. But remember, these are selling out. So if you want one, do quickly. Please, please put it in your basket, but don't forget to check out because otherwise somebody else will take it out of your basket. You can check out as many times as you want. The 10% discount code will be applied to your whole basket, not just one product. Now, these are very like low, these are our sort of end of stock. We don't have a lot of these left. This has only got four metres remaining of it. So this is in the Liberty Carnaby collection. Beautiful. Beautiful. Goes very nicely with that one. And that one. Mm. Beautiful together. Make a tie, make a Liberty tie from half a metre. Just saying. Maybe I should have done these in colours. Oh, let's, let's take... Just going out of order. There's the lovely flowers. I love that one. There's only two metres of this one remaining. Isn't that gorgeous? Um, 
If you've already bought it before the price has been lowered, don't worry, you will be charged the final, the final price, which is $5.99, and the 10% will come off your whole basket. Love the reds, greens, and blues in that one. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Right, about to sell out. Lovely. Um, this is the same, but a different colourway as the second one that I showed. Ooh. Again, it's five ninety nine. Obviously, this is from the Carnation Collection. You see, if you've bought the first one, if you bought that one, look how lovely are those together. Imagine two half square triangles in those. Oh. Right, so that one has sold out. Now I'll put that on the trolley. Um, we'll just go through them randomly. Very, very pretty one. Ivory colour background, little sprigs of flowers, all in pinks, blues, yellows with some greens. The code on that one is YQYV95. Very pretty one. What collection is this from? Oh, this is from the Carnaby collection as well. Gorgeous Liberty fabric. I love that. Crashing obviously to five ninety nine plus the ten percent discount. Oh, getting it really close. Just little bouquets of flowers. Think ahead, you know. Think this isn't just about the stitching now and sewing now. This is about all of your next year's products. Get it while it's at a fantastic price. Five ninety nine plus your ten percent discount. What's the what's the price with the ten percent, Hannah? So that takes each half meter down to five pounds forty. Once you put your discount on there, five pound forty. For Liberty, I love this one. Beautiful red. As I said before, Liberty I mean, it is a lovely bright red, but it's got that Liberty edge to it. It's a classic vintage red. It's just beautiful. Very, very fresh. Little white flowers all over it. Five ninety nine, but works out actually at five pound forty. Once you take your ten percent discount, that's beautiful, isn't it? And obviously a lot, you know, if when you look on the website, if you're wanting to buy these, you will see them all together. You can see how lovely they go. So if you're thinking, I'm going to make a Liberty quilt, this is the year I'm going to make it. Choose your fabrics now, but please do check out because don't they go together? Gorgeous. Next, we've got purple. This one is... FVYV70, beautiful lilac shade of lilac-y mauve background with purple, green, yellow and white flowers, lovely all over print very, and it's really nice because it's one of the very easy to use print, perfect for patchwork particularly when you're cutting things on angles when you're doing triangles, flying geese, half square triangles, that sort of thing because it is so multi-directional, it won't matter, you know, pattern matching or that kind of thing, you won't notice because it's all over the place so this sort of thing is ideal for that but also very, very pretty when you want to make homeware items as well. Now we've got a lovely pale blue one next. This one is RTYV35. This one is from the Carnaby collection again, Cosmos Cloud. Lovely shades. Look at this, isn't it lovely? You've got pale blue background with all different shades of blues and white, making a beautiful all over sort of floral blue pattern. Five ninety nine, five pound forty. After once you've added your ten percent discount on Liberty fabric, gorgeous. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. You know what though? This problem. I want this fabric. Shouldn't be my hobby as well, should it? Because they're all going to sell out, and I won't be able to get any. And I know which ones I want as well. Um, this same as the red one. 
but it's like a midnight blue background with pale blue flowers. E L Y V O eight. You see, this is look same as that. Only half a meter of that one left. There's a lot of you who've now worked out what we're doing. That they're all five ninety nine, and I'm going ahead on the website and buying, which I'd not blame you because I'm annoyed that I'm not doing that. Oh, now I like this one. Have we got any of this one left? That is NSYV79. Gorgeous, isn't it? It makes me think of that Mille Fiori, you know, the uh, Murano glass when they make it and they c cut the glass and it's just thousands of flowers all together. That's what that looks like. Yes, 76. Um, this is from the garden. Did I? Sorry, it's reading upside down. Yeah. Don't ever read upside down. Um, this is from the Carnaby collection. Again, quilting weights, Liberty Cotton. Gorgeous. Not enough left. Not enough. Not enough for me. Yes, that's all I'm interested in. This one's lovely because it's tiny. We'll have to get close to this one. Tiny, tiny daisies. P R Y V 79. But it's on a lovely grass green background. So if we can get close on that one. They're just tiny, it's just so Liberty, isn't it? Again, from the Carney collection. P-R-Y-V-79. Daisy Dot. And it's got just tiny, so from a distance, they look like just little dots. But when you get up close, they're tiny daisies. I'm thinking E-P-P. -P. Be brilliant. Oh, there is another daisy dot. Yeah, we'll do that one next. Yes. Um, this, but they are just tight. Be brilliant for EPP. You know, when you want to do tiny little things or if you're doing a plique and you want some l small details, but it's just so lovely because when you get in close, you can see those little daisies. Obviously, 5 99 for half a metre. Now, have exactly the same fabric, but in, mo in midnight... This is MKYV43. Tiny daisies, but navy. Well, no, midnight, actually. But you see, they just, I don't know how Liberty do it, but actually, look, don't they go well together? You've got the real green, the blue, but they look lovely. Then nice big floral print. This is summer. Do you remember summer? No. <laughs> Anna and Emma together just went, no, don't remember summer. OCYV29, isn't that one pretty? You've got a lovely, larger print this time, but you've got lovely Dijon mustard yellows, pink, blush pinks, blues and reds. 5.99 for half a metre, so pretty. Um, only a metre left of that one, please, if it's in your basket. Get it in your basket and do check out. Otherwise, if someone's in their basket and they check out before you do, then they'll have it. And then that would be a shame. I've got this lovely all over um, one again, but this is in like a, a sapphire blue background. Oh, 52, yeah. That one has sold out, but it will be 5.99. It will be five ninety nine. So anyone who's bought it already is don't worry, it will be five ninety nine. Um Ah, there's the Daisy <laughs> EPYV seventy two. I love the blue shade of the background of this. It's a real um not like your super bright royal blue. Strong, a strong blue, but it's not like really vibrant. It's just a lovely deep blue with little blue sprigs. In fact, it's the same. I've just realised. It's like playing snap with fabric, isn't it? It's the same as this fabric here that we showed you earlier. Same print, but just different colour. About to sell out. Right. Um, now, I found that daisy one that we were having a problem with. So, different daisies. So, look, that one is the original daisy. 
and that's the slightly different green daisy. XVYV50. Right, so this one, if you want to see the difference, this is, I would say, more of an apple green. And the one I showed you before is more of a grass green. So when you look on the website, the colours are slightly wrong. They've put the image of the this one on. So this here, what is that one called? What's it called? I can't see that. Dark green. Right, so it's like an apple green. The other one is much a bluer green, it's more of a grass green. But that one is apple green. The picture on the website is of the other one, just to confuse you. Yeah, they they double booked a picture. But they are daisies as well. Just depends whether you want grass green or apple green. Right, we've got that same small print again, but in a apricot, I'd say, background. Very pretty, isn't it? It's better than a plane. It's like a plane with a print. But a lot, when you get a plane, you know when you need a plain fabric to use in the background or something for like borders or sashing or whatever, but it's better than that because it has more texture to it. Again, 5 99 for half a metre. Woo, 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 woo. Right, this one is the same as that blue one there. Lovely, small, spriggy print. Oh, that one is, well, my was upside down. IHYV74. Lovely, very, very pale, pale sky blue with these little bouquets of flowers and the odd little sprigs. Very Liberty. £5.99, £5.40 with your discount, with your 10% BF2021 discount. Don't forget, put it in your basket and check out because there's a lot of you going ahead on the website and buying the fabric and then it's selling out. So if you want it, you need to get it into your basket. Right, I've got exactly the same print, but in a different colourway. But if you haven't put your code on, don't worry. Um, just give the customer service team a ring. They will be able to sort that out for you. But, but don't forget, the discount code will be applied at midnight to your whole basket, not just the point at which you put the code in. It will be your whole basket. Now, this is the same print but with an ivory background. So if you've missed the other one, which is that we showed you at the beginning, which is quite similar to this, there's a little bit more in a slightly different colourway. 5 99 which is £5.40 after your discount. Amazing. Have we ever sold Liberty at this price before? Not these. Not these. Yeah. Not as much. I've never seen such... I mean, we might have sold the odd one or two if we had a few, a little bit left the end of season but not in this volume, being very generous. So we're trying to di disprove the Black Friday's a scam theory. Um, JBYV62, because it isn't with Sewing Street, this is genuinely, we are reducing our full price fabrics just today. Well, or until stocks laughed. 5.99, that is, it's fabric snap, isn't it? I've seen that one. Hmm. Yeah, I've got it in a blue somewhere. Like I feel like I'm in the shop. Now, I haven't got that one, love, but I've got it in a blue. But I can't find it. Right, then I've got, oh, the Rebute. I love these tiny prints. This is what makes me really think of Liberty, these little, little prints. And actually, this is available in quite a few colourways as well. KHYV76. So I have got that. I'll show you in a minute. I've got it in a blue and a green as well. And we've also had it already in, um, I think, a pale blue. I think these fabrics are dissolving. 
<laughs> yeah, I think it's, I think the fabrics off my desk must be going into people's baskets because I'm like, I'm sure I've seen that one already. <laughs> so <laughs> I've now got this one in a green. I'll put that one out and then you can see what they look like together. Bloomsbury Blossom, this one is called. And this code in the green is ZQYV93. So let me show you what it looks like, the whole thing. And then I'll show you what it looks like with its friend. Don't these go together well? Look. There's the two. There's the green. Right. I've got it in a blue. Which is KZYV32. So that's it in a blue. And that's what they look like together. Look, what a beautiful trio. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? The blue was sold out though, unfortunately. Right, I have got two more, two more, which are matching, hooray. No, the lovely pink one, which has got butterflies on. Um, the Carnaby collection called Fluttering Floral. Emma thought they were sheep. I'm s I can see why you think that, because if you look at these flowers really carefully, they've got white on the outside and black on the inside, which is why Emma thinks they look like sheep. But they're actually flowers and butterflies. Flutterfly, flutter, f fluttering floral. So that's fluttering floral with a pink background. But we also have it, this is the last one, fluttering floral with a green background. Right, that is the Liberty done. Now, if there's any of it left, do have a look, quick look on the website because then you'll be able to see all the pictures. So if you're thinking, of, well, I know I want two or three of them, but I want to see if they go together, it will be easier um, if you have a look or if there's any that you want to see again if we've got them then just please do message the studio and I will show them to you studio at sewingstreet.com we love your messages so please do send them in um, cave cave in the black tag okay mm liberty how lucky am I today black tag gorgeousness so this is a pack of fat quarters 20 pieces of, oh look, instead of me opening the pack, that is what it looks like. 20 fat quarters, normally would be 79.99. But today, and today only, 69.99, plus you will get the 10% off, so you will get 6.99 off the 69.99 which will make it 63 pounds, 63 pounds for 20 CAIF fat quarters. That circle of gloriousness will be 63 pounds. Amazing. Don't forget, you do have to use, remember, don't forget to use your code. If you forget, phone the call centre, they'll sort it out for you. But it will be, it doesn't matter because it will be applied that if you buy something else and then you put it in, it will be um, applied to your basket at the end of the day. Bundle on Christmas fabric. Oh, I love this. Now, from Annie Downs, I did a show. Was it last? Was it Monday? We did some kits with this fabric. This is subtle... It's a bundle, gentle, beautiful Christmas fabric. Now, this is a bundle. We have got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, is it nine? Three, four, five, six, nine. Nine half meters of Annie Downs Christmas fabric. I mean, you just have to look at it. The colors are all muted and vintage and gentle. Um, 
This one has got all these images on it. Decorate the Christmas tree with tinsel and sparkly stars, dressed up in festive attire. So this is normally £62.91 and pence for four and a half metres, so nine half metres of this beautiful fabric is crashing to £44.99. So you are saving £17.92. However, you can save an extra £4.49 when you use the code. I mean, this is beautiful, isn't it? It's got hot chocolate in it, which says you're saving over £20. Drink eggnog by the warm firelight. That's just one of them. I'm going to show you the others. It's very hard to read. And there's biscuits. And then we've got this beautiful one. Oh, yeah, bar humbug. And look, let me just show you that. There's the humbug. And it says, watch out for the humbug. <laughs> there's always one, isn't there? There's always one. This lovely one with the little presents on. Really good for doing things like reusable caf crackers or your gift bags. Or how about um, napkins? Half a metre. Half a metre makes two napkins, doesn't it? 18 napkins. And they are beautiful. This is Henry Glass fabric. This is made for Henry Glass. So it is really beautiful beautiful soft drape fabric it's perfect for napkins and they're just lovely aren't they i like the fact like this one's got holly on the background so you've got some that are very small patterns um you've got that uh, that beautiful one that i showed you with all the words on but in a different in a different colorway but the same thing they'd be lovely to have as napkins wouldn't they everyone going oh what does that say then um another one with words on in it christmas stockings and christmas trees baubles mistletoe and humbugs the um the illustrations are absolutely charming aren't they really are i love there's the humbug again beautiful really sort of um vintage naive charm to this one there's the we've also got the christmas presents again in this pack but with the pink background then there's the um, all over print with pink. What's the code, please? What for the Black Friday? The code for Black Friday is BF2021. BF2021 is the Black Friday code for the 10% off. This is gorgeous, isn't it? So you get, oh, there's only one of these left. Is that my one? And then you get the holly for the last person who's going to get this. And then you get the lines of words there. Fantastic price. Gorgeous. Where are they? Here. Panels. Oh, sorry. I had something else on top of them. It's very warm there. <laughs> it's really weird. No, I think that's where Cara must have had her iron because it's really warm. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's where my fabrics are dissolving in that section. These are Riley Blake panels. These are gorgeous. If I hold them up, will you be able to see them? Can you see that? Because I can't see. Can you see it all? Now, the good thing about Riley Blake is it's really good to quality. It's really, really soft. Right, so that's the grey one. I do like the way it's got the dotted lines around it. Beautiful for the centre of a quilt. Or just as a hanging. Hannah wants it as a play mat. I'm not sure what she's going to do on it. It'd be lovely if it was a big floor cushion, wouldn't it? Gorgeous. Um, 
That one is now eleven ninety nine. It's ever so soft as well. But a really lovely piece of wall art. Just quilt round it, embroider on it, applique on it. We've got the same one. So that's the grey background one. Got exactly, is it exactly the same? Yes. But, so let me shake. With an ivory white, white background. That's nice, isn't it? Was $15.99. But today, well, and while stocks last, or until midnight, it's eleven ninety nine. Plus one pound nineteen off your ten percent discount with code BF twenty twenty one. But you can cut them up. You can use them for different things. You can use cut up the individual elements. You don't have to use it all as one piece. Eleven ninety nine plus your discount. That's the Riley Blake panels. Right, just got to fold these up. Gemstones, bright rosette panel, I wonder what they'll be called. Right, I've got a handyman panel. I love the handyman fabric collection. Fabric is, is for hobbies as well as flowers. Man cave, it isn't just for Christmas, it is for hobbies as well. I like this panel. I think it's really clever because it's got like that sort of, um, those metal plates you have on things, foot plates on the background. I don't know what they're called, textured things. And then you've got the whole, actually, it must be, is it this way? Yeah. So you can use this as one panel, centre of a quilt, big cushion, Cut out the individual bits. So this is your tool board. So it was nine ninety nine for the panel. You've even got this, all the screws and the tape measures, the little boxes and hinges. And then on this side, you've got the, you know you get all those plastic boxes with all the sort of the nuts and bolts and screws. And then you've got the individual tools. So you could use this as a whole thing. It'd be make a lovely thing to hang on a wall, wouldn't it? But you could also cut out the individual bits. So if you wanted to use them for a plique, and you think, well, actually I just want a spanner, cut that out for 4 99 plus the 49 pence of um, your 10% discount. That's a fantastic price, isn't it? Don't forget, BF 2021. Nice for um, if you were doing a child's quilt as well, wouldn't it? Or if you're buying somebody a toolkit, make them a little bag to put it in. That would be nice, wouldn't it? You'd look, imagine how um, jealous your workmates would be if you turned up on site with a tool belt made from the tool, from the fabric. Fantastic. Lunch bag. You could make somebody a lunch bag from this. It'd be so sweet. You could use it for loads of things. Or if you wanted to be a little bit more subtle, you could maybe line the lunch bag with it if you felt there was going to be any hint of embarrassment on the building site. But it is beautiful, isn't it? I think I would use it to cut out the individual elements, actually. It's lovely. But, you know, when you have, like, with children, have sort of play kitchens and play workrooms. But this could be, or you could use, use this as a little curtain underneath it or something, couldn't you? There's so many things you could do with it. Four ninety nine, Got to be worth it. Hannah wants one now. <laughs> or PE bag. Could be. Um, I have got... Riley Blake, Ta -da! yes. When you've got a shop with so many items, it's so hard to find things. Now, in this pack, there are two panels. Oh, there's two things. So this is Christmas at Buttermilk Acres. But on the panel, you're getting two, two designs. So you've got Father Christmas at his desk, and then you've got the checked. And then, above it, on the same piece of fabric, 
There's Father Christmas with his reindeer. So is this together? Right. So you get the two scenes on one panel, but plus, plus, in the same price for the 1998. It's the same. Right. There is, no, so those are two are the same. Right. We've obviously got the wrong one. So you should be getting two panels. The one that I've shown you, which is the the reindeer and Father Christmas at his desk, and then the other one, which is Father Christmas climbing down the chimney. And what's the one at the bottom? With his sack. Anyway. <laughs> and I thought it was a roadblock. Santa at the roadblock. I think maybe that's a sleigh. Although I guess a sleigh could be a roadblock, couldn't it? Santa on his way to the roadblock. Road works. Um, anyway, both of these panels together are 1998. Well, they were 1998, but not anymore. Let me just tell you how big they are, in case you were thinking cushion, Santa sack. They measure 60 centimetres across. Obviously, you have to bear, take into account seam allowances. Well, actually, let's just do the cream bit inside. They are 50 by 51 so and then obviously you've got the check bits around the edge but they're ba basically 50 centimeter squares and you will be getting four two on each but they are 13.99 again don't forget your 10 percent off with your bf 2021 um i'm thinking sacks beautiful christmas cushions very classy but present sacks remember if you don't want to um Spend money on Christmas wrapping paper that just gets thrown away. Make everyone a drawstring bag. You've got four here. Use some plain fabric or an old sheet or something for the back. Make a drawstring across the top and that's your present wrapped. And you can get them back off them and use them to wrap everything next year. We had a load of panels about a month or so ago that we were using that we could make sacks out of. I think it's a fantastic idea because then you don't waste your wrapping paper and everybody loves to have a present wrapped in a bag. Um, have we got time, Hannah, for anything else? Yeah. What should we do? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's go fly. This one. Oh, is that called Let's Fly? No, it's called On The Go. Pardon? So, this really confused me. So, this is called On The Go. So, the kit includes everything you need. I really don't want to open this thing. In case I break it. Oh, oh no, it's coming. There we go. just didn't want to break it. So, in the kit is everything, instructions, and it's Moda all the fabric that you need to make this gorgeous quilt. It's 99, $99.99, which means you can buy it on split pay. And there's the quilt. The quilt is 61 by 72 inches. So it's perfect for children's um, play mat or to hang on the wall or for a smaller bed quilt. I love the fact that you've got the, the lines and then the aeroplanes at the top. Um, Crashing to sixty nine ninety nine plus an extra six ninety nine off with your BF twenty twenty one. That's a fantastic price, isn't it? But do you know what? Even but you know you could you could just buy it for the fabric, or you could just buy it for the instructions and use your own fabric. But you've got all the fabric that you need. You can make it into the red arrows. Lovely, isn't it? I really like that. So this includes everything for the quilt top and the binding as well. Beautiful classic design, but I love, love the mode. And the, um, the fabrics they used in the stripes, they've got little aeroplanes all over them. Gorgeous. But, you know, you could use, I think often with these kits, 
be lovely to use this as, you know, if you wanted to use your own fabric with it or use the fabric for something else at that discount. So you, and if you want to split pay, if you don't want to um, pay it all in one go, you can split it to two payments of 34.99, even better. Mode of fabric, nice gift as well, because it all comes in a box. These things are important. That's on the go. Have we got time for any more? This one. So this is the fat quarter bundle of the Beth Studley fabric. Mm. It's rather nice, isn't it? So this is 89, well, was 89.99. How many have we got here? 24 fat quarters. Now, if you've seen the Beth Studley patterns and you've seen all the different things she makes, these are her fabrics. They're gorgeous, aren't they? 24, should we show you? One. Crashing. One, two, three, four. Purples and yellows. 78.99 for 24 fat quarters. Aren't they gorgeous? Shades of purples and yellows. If you've seen the pictures when we sell her um, instructions kits, you will always see these fabrics. They're lovely, aren't they? And obviously you'll get another £7.89 off when you use BF2021. Look at these. 24 fat quarters. Beautiful prints and patterns and the colours in shades of cerise and purple and ochre and teal. So that price after your BF2021, it will be £71.10. and pence. Look at those. Gorgeous which makes these less than three pounds a fat quarter. I think they're absolutely gorgeous. I love the colours. And the fact that you've got all different colours and then in some of the fabrics, the colours are combined as well. So like with this one, you've got a little bit of all of the colours. Let me just show you. Beautiful, isn't it? So that's a fantastic bargain. 20 fat quarters. We've also got these. We've got these in um, smaller bundles as well. Right, one of them is sold out. I'll consider that later. <laughs> the ribbon situation later. This one, right, that one's gone. This one. So how many is in this one? Twelve. Twelve in that one. So the same, but these are the blues. The blues and the purples and the teals section. That is forty-four ninety-nine for 12 fat quarters. But not today, because today is Black Tag Day. So today it's thirty-nine ninety-nine plus 10% off everything. So that's £3.99 off your thirty-nine ninety-nine. BF2021. Don't forget, 10% off your whole basket. Mm. Yeah, by the time you get to the end of the show, you'll be really good at taking 10% off. Look at that. Beautiful. So that's for the 12 fat quarters. Um, right, we've gone over a little bit. Now we need to go and have a break because we've got Cara coming on next to show us how to make the Gnome Spectacular show. Can you see the gnomes up above me? We've got lady gnomes, men gnomes and children baby gnomes as well. So thank you for joining me in this hour. Um, it is 10% off everything today, so Cara's next hour will be 10% off hers too. I'll see you back here in just a couple of minutes' time. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day.
Hi, I'm Claire from Native Lighting. I set up Native Lighting 18 months ago when I realised there was a real lack of craft lights in the market that were high quality, affordable and modern. Not only do Native Lighting lamps give you the perfect lighting for your craft, but they also look amazing in your home as well. I started to train as a florist when I was much younger and it re made me realise how you need the light on all the different colours when you're trying to match the colours with the flowers. And that's what's really important with your crafting as well. I've been in the lighting industry for 10 years and worked in many different sectors, but my heart always lies with crafting. I think that also comes from my time of training as a florist when I just used to love working with all the flowers and the colours and how different they could look in different colours of light. My top advice would be, when you're thinking about buying a light, you need to think about where you're actually going to be doing your work. We've got lots of different types of lamps. We've got floor lamps, we've got magnifiers, we've got portable lamps, and we've got desk lamps. If you're sitting in a sofa or a chair, I'd suggest that you use one of our floor lamps. If you're working with intricate details, then have a look at one of our magnifiers. We've got three different types here. We've got our seven inch one, we've got our four and a half inch one, and then we've got a desk version here as well. All of those magnifiers have all three different color settings, including the really important daylight for your color matching, and they've all got brightness settings on them as well. If you work with a sewing machine, our Lumina lamps are absolutely amazing because you can bend and wrap them around the sewing machine, which is brilliant for when you're working on a sewing machine and you can get that light exactly where you need it. If you do Facebook Lives or you like to um, do video tutorials for people or you're doing teaching online, then our ring light is amazing for that because you can obviously use that, put your mobile phone in there and also that we've got a remote control which will operate that for you. You may have a cutting table or a wide area that you need to light up. Then I'd suggest you go with our, our task lamp here which gives you a really wide spread of light. If you're on the move, when you're working, then we've got a selection here of portable lamps. We've got our reverse lamp, our zigzag lamp, and our LED desk lamp. These are rechargeable, so it means that you can charge them up and then you can take them with you and you've still got light when you're on the move. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there! Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433 and for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! We know that shopping online can be a confusing and sometimes daunting task and sometimes all you want to do is talk to a human being. Well our family run customer service team are on call 24-7. They're full of friendly, warm-hearted individuals all trained to make your shopping experience as easy and as enjoyable as possible. And not only will they take your order, they will also help and guide you on your shopping journey so you never miss out. In need of a crafting fix. There are so many ways you can watch Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Sewing Street is live from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. every day on Freeview 72 and Sky 670. 
Alternatively, if you want to watch us on a tablet or on the move, you can tune in on our YouTube channel, the Sewing Street app, or the websites at www.sewingstreet.com and www.yarnlane.com. You can watch past shows on Sky 670 from 1pm every day, as well as our YouTube channel, the app, and our website. Yarn Lane is on from 12pm to 1pm. Visit our programme guide to find out when and what's on. So you never have to spend a minute without us. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street and Yarn Lane, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. For Sewing Street, head on over to www.sewingstreet.com. Scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. It's exactly the same for Yarn Lane. Head on over to www.yarnlane.com. Scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and that's it. You are now subscribed to both Sewing Streets and Yarn Lane's email newsletters. So you'll never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. And welcome back to Sewing Street, to the gnome hour. Look, they just all look at my gnomes. Do you want to see them? They're a bit shy, a bit shy. So we've got um, Mr. Gnomes and Mrs. Gnomes, and we have a choice of colourways, and we also have baby gnomes. So this is Mrs. Gnome, look. This is the red Mrs. Gnome. Look, She has plaits, obviously. And she's got a little apron with a little pocket. She has got long legs, so she can be a doorstop. Or, I have some of these, and they just sit next to my fire at Christmas. But actually, they're sort of thinking they don't have to be Christmas. You can have them out in the winter, a bit like November lights. I always have lights that I put in my, crisp, in my kitchen in November, because in Scandinavia, because it gets dark so early, they always put all the white lights up in November and December, and then put all the decorations. So they just put on their tree the lights, and then in December they put the decorations on. So these are perfect for this night dark time of year. So that's Mrs. Gnome in red. This is Mr. Gnome, but in tartan. So he's a bit of a black watch tartan boy, isn't he? I think he must be Highland Gnome. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think? Or Haggis Gnome. Haggis Gnome. <laughs> so they have long hats, pom-poms. So Mr Gnome, look at his... Is that hair? Is it his hair or his beard? A bit of both, I think. A bit of both. Actually, yes, his unclipped eyebrows. He has little pockets on his shirt and stripy legs. Aren't they lovely? Beautiful for doorstops or decorations. So that's the um, the Highland Gnome. But then if you want the grey gnome, this is Mrs Gnome in grey with a little apron that um, ties at the back. And she has a pom-pom on her hat. And we also have every panel comes with its own baby gnome. So this is the red baby gnome. Look. The little plaits, little girl plaits, with little feet and little boots and a big pom-pom. And then this is the little girl with the grey one. I'll show you the panels in a minute so you can see what you get on each of the panels. I just wanted to show you what the gnomes look like. I love their little noses. And what's great about them is often the hardest thing to do when you're making toys or gnomes or any animals is the eyes and the features but you don't need to bother about that because their hat covers their eyes and their nose is just a stuffed circle so you don't have to worry about getting the features right which is brilliant so let me show you the panel so you can see the choice and decide which gnomes you're going to have i have a mr and mrs gnome and they sit by the fire and they look so lovely so the red gnome now on the panel this is Mr. Gnome. On the panel, you get Mr. Gnome. Oh, he's called Knitted Gnome. Oh, yeah, I guess. So. Yes, because his pattern's like knitting. Um, but you get Mr. and the baby matching. But he's called Knitted Gnome because um, 
it's like a knitted fabric. All the pieces are here. You've got the arms, the bases, the boots, hands. You've got the body front. You've got the hats. Everything that you need is on there. Um, and you also get in this in the instructions, quite important. So everything that you need. So what you will need as well as this that isn't on the panel, you will need some wool for his beard. We have got that available separately. I'll show you that in a minute. Some small buttons for the front, optional. Pom-pom for the hat. You will need soft toy filling and you'll need weighted filling if you want it to be a doorstop. So you can use, we've got plastic pellets that I'll show you, but you can use rice, sand, gravel. You get a baby on here as well. So this is the red, I mean this is the girl, girl version just so you can see, but you will get a baby, Mr. Gnome and the ba matching baby gnome. So all the instructions, everything you need to know will be in here. So this is 19 99 for the full kit, but remember if you use your 10% off code today, BF2021, you will get £1.99 off that. Everything you need to know, and there's a picture. So obviously this picture is of the um, tartan gnome, but it's the same instructions for making both of them. So everything you need, other than the filling and the things I've just said are on here, to make Mr. Gnome and his son, the knitted gnomes. Those are the red knitted gnomes. Now, if you would like to make Mrs. Knitted Gnome, and you're thinking, mm, I'd like to have both of them, because then you'd have a whole family of red knitted gnomes, this is the kit you need for this one. Let me show you the panel. So there we go. So on the panel, we've got the body, the apron tie, the hat, um, there's the sole of the boot, the arms, there's the nose, so there's the like the Mrs. Gnome, Mrs. Gnome's nose, baby gnome's nose, you've got the legs, apron, so everything that you need to make Mrs. Gnome and her daughter. And obviously you get the full instructions here. There we go, step by step, very easy to see, very easy to understand, everything you need. And they both have plaits as well. So they need the same because she she has wool as well for her, but her, the wool is used for her hair. So that's Mrs. Gnome. Right, next is the blue gnomes. So we start with Mister. So that's this one here. The Highland Gnome. Actually, it's probably not. It's probably got a proper name, hasn't it? Tartan. Tartan Gnome. Right. There we go. There's the whole panel. So again, you've got everything to make Mister Gnome and a Baby Gnome. Boots, backs, hands, legs. I love the love the stripy legs, and the um, it's even got tartan for the pockets. It's really sweet, isn't it? So that's Miss Gnome. Again, you always will you always get full instructions. Nineteen ninety nine for the kit, but when you use your BF twenty twenty one ten percent off code, that would be one pound ninety nine off that. Now, if you want to make Mrs. Tartan Gnome with her daughter. You need this is the panel for Mrs. Gnome and her daughter. It's a lovely print, isn't it? Apron, she has apron tie, boots. Oh, I love the um, apron for this one because we haven't got um, a version of this Mrs. Gnome, but look, she's got um, like purple with hearts and a nice scalloped edge but then the baby gnome because it's too small it just has the um the apron printed on it so it works really well well there's also gift tags on here as well so if you want to make these gnomes for somebody you can put the gift tag on and give them to them message from great panel instructions i've already made one and sitting stuffing the arms and legs for the second from adrienne in norfolk oh thank you they are gorgeous aren't they i say i bring mine out every year and they sit by the fire 
looking lovely. But you can bring them out of this, you know, they, do, they don't have to be Christmas, they definitely don't have to be Christmas gnomes. Well, they don't even need to be winter gnomes, they can come out any time of the year, but they sort of feel wintry, don't they? Now, if you want the grey one, which is called Fair Isle, this is Mr. Fair Isle, and it has obviously the baby, his son as well. Look at his stripy legs. He's got very stripy legs, I love those. But it's lovely because on the mist, actually that's, that's the female one, it's got all the pockets separately. But for the baby gnome, the pockets are printed on just because it'd be too fiddly otherwise. I love the way that the boot sole looks like a bauble. So that's Mr. Farrell Gnome and his son. With instructions, obviously, that I showed you before, you get full instructions with each of these. And then if you want Mrs. Gnome and her daughter, Fair Isle, you have to name them yourself. We've got the hats, legs, boots, everything for Mrs. Gnome and her daughter. They're called baby gnomes, but I think they do need to have names, don't they? They've even got on these panels the bags, fabric bags, because when you add filling to your gnomes, you should always put them in a fabric or a plastic bag because otherwise the filling escapes and starts leaking around the gnome. So the fabric bags for making them, and it's better if you put fabric ones because the plastic ones crinkle a bit. So these are even on here, so you've got the one for the big gnome and the little gnome. So really it's just the filling and the wool that you will need on top of that. Now, we've also got a couple of bundles with a little bit of a saving. Right, so on this bundle, <laughs> sorry, we're just checking what's, what's in the bundle. I think we've got ourselves a bit mixed up here. Right, so in the bundle you get Tartan, Mr. and his son panel. Yeah? Do you... What? Right, so this... So this bundle has got... Mr. No Mr. Gnome in Tartan and his son, Mr. Gnome in Fair Isle and his son, and the, and the Mr. Instructions. So if you want two Mr. Gnomes and two baby gnomes, that's this bundle, £29.98. £29.98. So if you want two gnomes and two baby gnomes and the instructions, but you get the Fair Isle, so you'd get basically these two. Well these two colourways, not these two because you get two men and that's a men and a lady, but you get the fair out. So you, if you want a pair of gnomes in different colourways, th then you, that's what's in this bundle. So you get two, you get two men, but it means you get different colourways. But if you want two women instead, in one in Tartan and one in Fair Isle, that's this kit here. So you get Tartan, Mrs. and a daughter, Fair Isle, Mrs. and a daughter, and the instructions. Then um, that's this kit here. We were really confused, but that's, I think that's how it all works. Um, if you want any of the other products that you need, so you will need a packet of stuffing. That's a, more than enough to stuff a gnome and their daughter to do you both, or their gnome and their son. You've got a lot of gnome stuffing here. Three ninety nine if you need. This is really nice stuffing, by the way. I use this quite a lot. And with stuffing, normally you have to sort of pull it all apart to give it a bit of loft, and you don't have to do that very much with this. It's a really nice stuffing. If you want to add weighted filling to your gnomes, this is perfect because these are recycled polythene pellets. A kilo is more than enough. And although they're expensive, although although they're heavy, why is it expensive? Although they're heavy, um, 
and therefore expensive to send. It won't cost you any extra postage. But these are perfect because the pieces are quite small. Um, I've filled quite a lot of my doorstops with gravel and things, and gravel for my path. And it's really lumpy, but this is quite nice and small, which means it sits better in the doorstop um, and is more malleable. So this is quite nice and it's recycled as well. Um, if you need some wool, which you will need for the hair or the beard, we've got this lovely super soft three ply white acrylic yarn, which is absolutely perfect. Because, because it's three ply, it makes a really nice fine pom pom. Once you get thicker than that, that's fine, but you will get a finer look by using the three ply, so that's perfect. That's the super soft baby three ply yarn. Um, pom poms, very important. So, the for the little pom poms, the small pom pom maker is ideal. And for the bigger pom-poms, this set, which has got um, this, that's extra small and small. I think this is medi two mediums. They make a 35 mil and a 45 mil pom-pom. Right, yes, this one's, this is, pack is called small. This is called extra small. So the extra small pack makes a 20 and 25 millimetre pom-pom. The small pack makes a 35 and a 45 mil pom-pom. Brilliant, very, very quick. Not like your old days of two circles of cardboard. You can make a pom-pom in a few minutes. Um, and two extra items. These are needle grippers. Brilliant for stuffing small spaces. If you've bought nothing else for your 10% off, get these. These are brilliant, particularly when stuffing little arms and hands and things because they grip hold of the stuffing like a pair of tweezers and then you push them into... Um, the space and then you undo them and it's a really good way of getting them in. I think they were used originally in surgery but are now used in stuffing things. Right, anyway, I think that's everything. Hello, Karma. Hello. Hello. I think we've got through all of the kits. So oh I think my I confused gosh, there's myself. so many, so many. There's lots and lots and lots of gnomes. Lots so, uh, and loads of gnomes. Which one's your favourite? Oh gosh, I think the tartan one. I love yeah. the tartan one. Love yeah. the tartan one. It's gorgeous, yeah. isn't it? But they're all gorgeous. It mm. depends on your decor as well. Well, it does, doesn't it? Yes, yes. definitely. And what your theme is for um, Well, they don't Christmas. have to be Christmas, do they? As no, well, you sort of think all. that because gnomes are not just for Christmas. No, definitely not. But they sort of feel like that a bit, yeah. though, don't they? Yeah. So where do we start with this? Okay, We've opened um, the pack. What, what yeah, would you suggest? So um, open the pack and the first thing you'll do is cut out all the pieces. And um, what I did was actually cut out the baby items, the small items, and kept those separate, and then um, cut the larger items and kept those separate. Um, what you can do is, when you're cutting them out, keep the label, or either mm. cut the label separately and pin it to each of the pieces, or with a friction pen right on the back of it. Right. Okay. So um, the that's very very straightforward the only thing that i would say is there are some notches so there's some notches here on the baby gnome front body and the legs and also on the body base and also on this is on the uh, big one as well so wherever there are notches you can either cut the notches out or what i did was just with um, a marking pencil just marked the actual fabric oh, just with okay. a very very small mark so you could cut, but you do need those. That's for the, your placement, right? And also um, for the bottom, the 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 sole of the boot as well. Okay. So, so you know, sit down, spend a bit of time, cut them all out. But as I say, keep them separate, or make sure that you keep the labels for right. them. So that's the first thing you, you'll do. Um, they have been on before, so I have sort of pre-prepped certain mm. things but there are certain things that I thought I'd, I'd go over again with you okay and um, but the instructions are brilliant you know they do take you through there's very clear photographs of everything as well um so I've actually already done the apron for the front of this one so um so you're making Mrs name I'm make, making Frida 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 um, so she's um, got a little apron there with a little pocket in which I think is really nice. So I was just going to run through um, making the arms and legs because um, those are things that need a little bit more skill if you like. Um, so you take two um, matching pieces for the um, feet and, or the boots and you're going to be um, machining round there a quarter of an inch. So that's what I'll do. 
but they are they're lovely and they're really really easy to sort of put together um, and they don't take long at all which is nice but again you know it's nice you can either make them as presents or you can give the kits as a present to somebody for them to make so I, I like that idea we were talking about that earlier when um, you know people actually it's nice to give them something that they can do over the yes winter it's months. my always great encouragement that people do crafts you see <laughs> but then it's but different people do different crafts don't they so you can you can always get a kit to suit somebody you can you can so I always like if I buy somebody a cookery book I'll often buy them like the cake tin Oh, or yes. Oh, the spatula nice or yes. just something very small that they specifically need. Yeah. So I've just um, gone round the actual base there. And again, with curve, you can either snip into the seam or you can use pinking Love shears pinking shears. To just do that. And then we're going to attach that to the leg. And you open this up. You can press it. Um, but you can finger press it as well. Just open that slightly. And then with right sides together, you match the centre of the leg and the stripes of the leg go down. So you want right sides together and you'll be, just pop a pin in the centre there, I think. Gosh, some of these pins are very long. <laughs> a little one and we're going to be machining across there as oh, so you sew in the bottom of the leg to the so we're top of the we're boot. sewing the bottom of the um, boot to the leg yeah and again quarter of an inch seam allowance and just make sure that your raw edges stay together especially when you get to the center you want that seam to be open if you can and then we'll either again you can press it or finger press it the seam open so we've just machined across there and we can just open that and just finger press that seam open. And then you'll match, and this is the important thing, is to match where that seam is. That's why you're opening it and pressing it open. And then we're going to machine down the back of the leg. Okay. And then I think the thing that um, some people find quite fiddly sometimes, and uh, it does take a little bit of practice if you've never done one before, is actually putting the sole in. Um, but there are some nice um, hints and tips for doing that. And um, I'll just go through that once I've sewn this. Okay. So is it best to start with the, um, the big gnome? I did, yes, definitely. To get the hang of how you yes, do it. Yes, yes. Um, on the little gnome, the um, the leg and the boot are together, so they're not. You don't oh, have to okay. stitch those, which is good. So we've just machined down there, and um, you think, oh, you open it, <laughs> um, turn it, turn it right side out. Um, so you want to again finger press that seam open, and just match those seams across and then what I do um, and I think um, it was Delphine that did it on the other show was um, I found it easier to actually just mark the halfway mark on the side there and this is going to be where you're going to be putting the, um, the sole and because it's a round sole going into this space, it just helps with um, the spread of the fabric and the stitches and everything if you just take the time and do this. So then we take, this is where I lose the sole. I've marked the sole quite clearly on here. You wouldn't necessarily mark it um, as clearly, 
I've marked it on the front and the back, but you want that mark to be in your seam allowance. But what's lovely about the pencil is that you can rub those out afterwards anyway. So, um, so that's my sole, and we're going to be popping it in like that. So that mark is the seam there, and this is where you want quite a few pins. And you're going to be pinning that so it, then we mark and match the seam at the side there. Do you, um, when you're doing um, mm. things like this, how do you, what pins I tips? always, well, sorry, <laughs> I was just watching. Um, I would always put the quarter marks like you do. Yes. Always. Yeah. Because it's just a lot easier. And then probably snip as well right so oh, okay if you snip the bottom of the straight edge the sole or the um no the actual leg the leg oh okay because then it just gives you that little bit of allowance doesn't oh, it okay so i mean it they do fit but if your seam allowance is slightly off or you know yes. it depends how far you sew in yeah snip within the seam allowance but yes. it just helps to get that curve oh no that's a, good a bit idea. but no i always do i'm whenever i put things i'm always like on half quarter eight yes. points depending yes. on how big it is and do you um machine from the bottom or from the top i machine from the not the rounded piece so from the top yes <laughs> <laughs> i'm just trying to think with other things yeah so if i was sewing like a round bottom to like a duffel bag yes i would keep this so the the, the bit that's shaped i always keep flat because that tends to stay flat yes. whereas the bit that you're bending round that's the one that you need to watch yes so that it doesn't get pleated yes you do have to keep picking up the bottom every now and then to have a look to make sure it's flat but yes and also um i found that um you know if you've never done it before try mm. it and if it doesn't work unpick it um or you can remachine it before you actually trim any of it yeah. and don't worry if there's little puckers it doesn't matter it doesn't no. matter at all. I, yeah i sort of go for level of because i quite often will have a bit of one i think how much do i mind is it a yes. big one or because once they're stuffed no that's right that's it right. doesn't really show up as much does no it? and I, I you know i think when you're doing as you say a round base on a bag or something like that we're going to do um this similar technique for the base of the actual gnome um, and I think when it's bigger, it's it's a lot, lot easier than it is when you're doing it in this tiny little sort of area. But as I say, just take your time, do a few stitches, do your needle down mm. on your machine. Um, but don't worry if you've got little puckers. No, it doesn't it matter. really, you know, I mean, I've got a few little puckers here. Um, just depends as well. You know, when you do your quarter of an inch, um, if you're exact on your quarter of an inch then you shouldn't have little puckers but mm. i've obviously when i was doing mine um wasn't exactly on the quarter of an inch but it is worth just taking a bit of time um and this is well yes you see, i mean i think i've done a, things like this a lot and really rushed it and then yes. actually spent more time unpicking or yes. not matching quarter points yes and then it not fitting and or it being odd, I think, you know, I if you've got a few gathers, it really doesn't matter if you've got um, gathers going round. I hate doesn't. unpicking. Yeah. <laughs> so, if there's anything I can do to avoid that, even this extra prep. I think the most important thing is when you've done it, is checking that you've actually caught the sole onto the um, leg. Yeah, it's also, I mean, I constantly sort of having a look underneath after you do every few stitches, is the yes. base still lying flat because yes. that's where it can some. And it's always, it's always where you're rushing and you end up with a pleat and things. You know, how did that happen? <laughs> and you, or you've machined over. Yes. You thought, hold on a minute, how did that happen? So, if I show you round. That's not bad at all, really, Beautiful. considering. But Beautiful. I have got a few um, little gathers. Yeah, but that's, but that's fine okay. because um, that looks natural. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is just Everyone's very Everyone's got their carefully. own bits of gathers, yeah. says Hannah. <laughs> You've it's got the Nora Batties, yes. It's the Nora Batties around the bottom. So I'm just using the pinkages just to go round there. And then we'll turn that through and we do some stuffing. 
and I love those needle grippers um, for when I'm doing toy making. I'm sure, weren't they, they originally? They used for surgery. Hem hemostats, they're called. I don't know what they're used for in surgery. Um, clamping. Clamping? Yes. Oh, what, like so, wounds or um, no. tubes? Oh, gosh, do we go into this on a Sunday morning? Oh, go on, yeah. No, I want to know what they're used for. Um, in an operating theatre. Mm. So if you want to clamp a vessel. You oh, use well, like these. a blood yes. vessel. Sorry. Sorry, everybody, especially if you're having your breakfast. <coughs> right, we'll change the subject. Yes, but, but they don't are use these at home they for that. They are absolutely perfect. Unless in an emergency situation. No. <laughs> yes. If anyone says, I need to clamp something, so you're using my needle grippers. <laughs> so I've used the needle grippers just to grab some of the um, cotton fabric. Well, yeah, because they're not just for stuffing. I mean, they're no. called needle grippers, so they're for used for pulling yeah, for, a needle through. For, for turning things. But for turning? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Absolutely perfect. And once you get it started, you can unclamp them. They are quite amazing, though, how they do hold. I know. Because if you ever tried using tweezers, not the, a No, hope. it's because it's got um, serrated. It's oh, quite serrated. Okay. And, it, you know, that's what grips. And then my trusty... Um, stick. Stick. Someone said to me the other day, and I still can't remember what it was, use a crochet Chopstick. hook. Yep. Brilliant. Yep. It's absolutely brilliant. And then yep. the dog ran off with it, and I found... <laughs> I must have dropped it on the floor, but I've, I've got some old plastic ones I don't like very much, and they are really yes. good. Yeah, especially if you've got um, a big crochet hook yeah. and it's got a lovely soft end. It's, yeah, um, no, it was a plastic one, and yes. it was quite, quite a big, like a five or a six mil. Yes. It was yeah. perfect, I hadn't yeah. thought of that, because I've been using kebab skewers up till now. Yeah, well, um, my chopsticks are good. So then you turn that all the way through, and because you've um, pinked that curve, you know, it comes out very well. And you've pinked around the bottom, and then what we do is we put some stuffing in. And I love this stuffing. It is it's really good, so isn't it? Because oh gosh, when I was younger, I don't know if anybody else can remember K-pop. K-pop, <gasps> really well. Yes. I remember we used to make felt toys. Yes. And it was like had seeds in, didn't it? Yes, yes. It was. It was lovely. Does it still exist, K-pop? I don't know. I can remember the smell of it as well. Yes. Yes. But um, what was this it is lovely. From? I think natural. I think it was natural because um, it did fibers. Have a, yeah, it did have a, um, a certain. But smell it was to very it. heavy. Yeah, I found. Um, what I like is about these ones. It, unless you want to use it, I mean, I've put um, the um, pellets in the bottom because when you want them to sit on a shelf, you want them to sit square. Yes. So yeah. if you didn't have any of the pellets or any of the gravel or rice or anything like that, you might find that your gnome will fly off the wall. Yeah, he does need a bit of bit of weight to him. Yes, so, um, you know, but this this is just lovely for... Well, I used an old cushion the other day because I never had filling, and I spent so long pulling, because you have to pull it all apart, the filling, yes. to get some air in, but that stuff you don't need to. No. I mean, when um, my mum used to make toys and things like that, and she made my sister and I um, teddy bears when we were little, mm. tiny. And um, they, she used, um, I, think, I don't know what it was, but it was sponge, and it was f small, tiny, tiny little squares. Like of sponge. sponge chips. Yeah, sponge chips. And um, but they were very lumpy teddy. Oh my gosh, yes. Yeah. So <laughs> after a time, um, after a few years. Yes. I needed to um, change the stuffing and um, put some of this stuffing in. It's so much better. But the sponge chips, I don't know if anybody else has got any um, toys when they were little, um, disintegrate. and I've seen they go um, like to powder almost, yes, don't they? Yes, which is not nice. And I don't know where I've seen that. But in... Um, in the the proper sort of real collectible bears, yes. they use um, something completely different, don't they? I don't um, know what do not, they use. Oh, I'm trying to think what they use. Is it like horsehair or something? Yeah, I think some there are lots. Those of really lots of stiff different, ones. Yeah, lots of different stuffings, and especially, um, you know, if you've got a mohair bear, you want the proper sort yeah, of stuffing that's with true. it. Yeah. God, I'd forgotten all about K-pop and the smell of it. <laughs> I remember making a kangaroo out of brown felt. And I can see it now and I can smell that K-pop. <laughs> Gosh. I know, that's really weird, isn't We've it? We've had re weird conversations this morning. I haven't thought about that for years. So what you're going to do is you're going to stuff the foot as firmly as possible, but you don't want to go really above the top of the boot. Okay, um, so that he has floppy legs. He has lovely floppy legs. So when you put him on the shelf. Although mine that sit by the fire, they're quite happy to sit 
they, you know, they will sit as door stops. Yes. But they do look nice on the shelf. Definitely, with the legs hanging down. And I can't show you that way. I could put them on the front. Can you see in there? Oh, look, his legs have got twisted. There we go. And what's nice is, um, you know, if you've got a shelf in your house, you know, they mm. do just sit on the edge, even the little ones. He's got a twisted leg. It's a special elf condition. Right. So now I've got two stuffed legs. <laughs> so once you've um, stuffed the foot, you will, don't worry, um, you can sort out the actual leg, open the seam again, and then just fold that in half. And what we're going to do is just machine across there, just to hold it in position. So you can make the stitch a little bit longer and you're going to stitch within the seam allowance. Okay. If I can find the foot. Oh, sorry. There we go. And then, whoops. Once you've done that, so we've just roughly um, gone across there and that's nice and flat now because you will be then attaching this. You want to make sure that your feet <laughs> face the right <laughs> side of the body. Um, <coughs> Unless you want body to your um, name to walk backwards. So that's pinned in position. So um, I'll just do one of the arms. So again, um, pop your stitch length back, quarter of an inch seam. K-pop fibres come from a seed pod harvest from the, what does that say, cell? Seba tree from Jackie in Hampshire. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Well, Jackie. there you go. Well, I knew that they had seeds in. Yes. Well, thank you so much for that message. I never, ever even thought about that. I thought it must have come from something. Yes, something natural. Um, I should say, if you get the grippers, make sure you hide them. I've had several pairs borrowed um, <gasps> for a minute, and I'm sure they're in a fish and tackle box. Oh, oh no, I love of course. Sent by making, Susan from West Midlands. And making flies. Oh, well, just it's just one of those things. It that is someone one goes, of those, yes. Have you... It's like I have a few pairs of jewellery pliers. Yes. They always go missing. I have yes. no idea what anyone even uses for them. <laughs> They're I, very handy. Like I have certain things that I just hide <laughs> because I just know that people borrow them. Fabric scissors. Actually, they've. I've told people off so much. Oh, I found gosh. them using my cutting mat for cutting <gasps> like sticky stuff one day. Oh no 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 no! People don't often walk into there, but I think you're right. Hide your needle. Yes, because they're very useful, aren't they? They are. They really are. I mean, I I'd never used them before. I started um, at sewing quarter. Oh, okay. And um, when I was making some animals and things like that, um, they are just so useful. So useful. Sorry, I've just moved that a bit. Years ago when I was working on was it Needle Craft magazine, I was making a Chinese lantern. Yeah. And I pulled the needle through the lantern because it was cardboard and fabric with my teeth. And I've still got a chip in my <gasps> teeth. Gosh. And I went to the dentist so many times they filled it up but it was fell out, so I've just got a chip. But didn't have needle grippers, you see. Never no, do it again. And Never I think pull a needle through fabric with your teeth. No, and I think um in toy making as well, I've used them a lot. You know, if you're um sewing eyes onto um, a character yes um, with a long needle and you're passing the needle through to to make the features and everything yes. I've used them then oh, yeah, and they are so, yeah. really really good for that well there's just sometimes if you're sewing things that are particularly like through a big through a seam or something you just can't get the needle through no no and and needles are very slippery aren't they so well, I have actually resorted to get my jewellery pliers out to pull them through, but these Ooh. are better. <laughs> it seems as they've always been stolen. Oops. Oh, I'm ha having fun here. Sorry, talk amongst yourselves. No, has it come unthreaded? <laughs> no, um, yes, it has, so that will take me a while. <laughs> <coughs> the misses and misses. Okay. Right, I'm just going to go through the misses, the misses and misses bundle. So if you would like to make a tartan gnome and a feral gnome, as in tartan and grey, 
Um, we've got a special bundle. So you get two misses, two ladies and two daughters. So Mrs. Gnome and her daughter in Tartar, Mrs. Gnome and her daughter in Farewell. And the instructions for the Mrs. Gnomes, that's at a special price of £29.98. Don't forget, if you use your special BF2021 code, you will get 10% off that. So you will get £2.99 off that price. And then you get to make two mummy gnomes and two baby gnomes. Now, if you would rather make two boy gnomes, so a Mr. Tartan and a Mr. Fair Isle and two and a baby tartan and a baby fair Isle, this is the kit that you need. Same price, $29.98. Oh, you get the instructions obviously as well with that. And remember that today and today only you will get 10% off that if you use your code BF2021. Now, if you've only just joined us and you wonder what that's all about, the 10% is off your whole basket. So if you've already shopped today and you've paid the you haven't put the code in and you've checked out, don't worry. It's off your whole basket. If you are if you haven't put it in and you're not going to do any more shopping today, give the call centre a ring, they'll sort it out for you. If you use the code yesterday, that's absolutely fine. You can use the 10% the off code yesterday and today. It's on your basket until midnight. So if at 10 o'clock tonight you think, oh, actually, I do want those needle grippers, it's fine. You can put them in. You'll still get the 10% off. So it's off everything. Everything that's, that I'm talking about today that's on there, everything on the website, all the sewing machines, which is quite a lot when you think 10%, the only thing it isn't off is gift vouchers. But everything else, even things that have already had a discount. So where we've got black tag things with, um, in, at 8 o'clock and 10 o'clock, and then in the next hour, we've got more black tag items, which means we've put special reductions. The 10% will be taken off as well as that as well. It just makes it simpler. It just got too complicated if we tried to go, you can't have it off of that, you can't have it off of that, it's just too complicated. We like to just keep it simple. Um, how are we getting on? Yes, fine. I'm sorry. The I machine is now mended. Yeah, it was just, it came un unthreaded. So um, sometimes I can thread them very quickly and sometimes it takes me a long I time. Know. I think, I'm not sure if this one's got um, a needle threader on it. Oh, it has. So I should have used should that. Should have used the needle threader. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> right. So I'm using my needle grippers again. I've grabbed a, a chunk of the um, cotton there and just turning it through. When you get to small items, so when you get to the um, small items on the baby ones, these are invaluable. Yeah, that's true, actually. So we just um, use my chopstick just to pop it through. I've clipped the um, seams as well with the pinking shears. And then just, and I'm going to use, it's lovely, the um, finer point on the needle grippers. Yes, because they're not sharp, are they? No, not at all. And you can just make sure because you want to make sure there's a nice shape to the hand here and you want to make sure that you push that through and then you'll take your stuffing and what I tend to do is wrap my stuffing around the needle grippers oh, okay. just a bit and then that you can actually push down and release where you're putting the stuffing and it just helps you get it right to the end. So what we're going to do is the same as with the, the leg. We're only going to stuff the hand and then I'll show you how to attach those. I think we're going to run out of time though. <laughs> so pop that round. Yes, but we have learned all about sewing round shapes on and the stuffing. <laughs> and it's, it's nice to learn in depth some details yes, rather I mean, than I skim have... across the whole thing because yeah. everything's in the instructions, everything you need to know about cutting it out, joining it together. But this is the stuff that you can't explain in detail. No, and I think, um, you know, if, if you haven't done, you know, like the sole of a boot or anything like that before where you're um, attaching it to a straight edge, mm. if you've got some spare fabric, cut you know you can cut round the shape yes and have and, a go and have a go until you feel more confident um because there's nothing worse than actually you know not feeling confident and you think you're going to not ruin mm. but you know it's not going to come out properly um then you know it is worth just doing it a little bit 
um, you know, until you feel confident. So, um, so you carry on stuffing that. I'm not going to stuff it all the way through. And then we, again, across the arm. So the seam goes in the middle again. And then we'll just do a few stitches across there just to hold it within the seam allowance again. And that's just to hold it there. And then this is where you bring this in. So you'll be attaching your arms. So your legs will go up like that. Your arms will go like that. But we're only going to be um, sewing these within the seam allowance. Just tack them through again with a long stitch just to hold them in position. Okay. And then, shall I talk you through this bit or how much How long time have we got, got left, Anna? About three minutes. Oh, okay. So you'll, <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry. Um, so you'll do your um, tacking stitch round either side there. You've got a big sandwich there. Yes. And then what you're going to do is just move your legs down out of the way and you'll put the, the body back and you're going to be sewing along here mm. so you're going to be doing a quarter of an inch seam from top to bottom or bottom to top both sides like that and then your bottom is um, left open you're going to add some gathering stitches so two lines of gathering stitches all around the top and then as we did before you'll mark um, the base yeah so you can mark your seams and everything. So you want to mark the bottom as well. And you'll um, pin that in position, same way as we did the sole of the foot. And then you'll machine all the way around that. And then um, you'll turn it all the way through so that your legs are in the right position, your arms are in the right position. But do remember, you are only just sewing down those ones first, then you need to put the base in. Right, okay, okay that makes sense. And then um, you'll turn it all the way through. You'll make your little pocket with the um, plastic pellets and that will be your base. If you want it to be a doorstop, I would actually fill that a little bit more. Well, yes, I guess that's enough to make it sit. Yes. But if you want it to hold open a door. Yes, I'd put more in you'll there. You'll need more. But that will be in the bottom of the actual um, gnome. And then you'll stuff from the top until it's quite firm. You'll pull the gathers up and then, do you want to pass me one of them? Shall I yes. do it with a... This one? Yep. I'll throw it. <laughs> Thank you. So um, we've machined everything. It's really, really nice and firm. You'll um, do your um, plaiting. I've got nice long ones. You can have whatever length um, plaits you like. You'll attach those to the top of the body mm. and then you'll place your hat over the top. <laughs> and just match that up and then you'll sew your nose on your nose has got just hand stitched gathering stitches there you'll put some stuffing in there pull it all up and then you'll attach that and no eyes are needed no eyes are needed i did think about putting some eyelashes on you oh, could you, easily put eyelashes oh yeah you on could actually something. well you could personalize them couldn't you you definitely could so um that's how you do it and i love a big pom-pom yeah that's nice isn't it <laughs> So, um, you know, if, if you want a bigger pom-pom than that, you can resort to yes, the Yes, I can't remember what size, what size is that. So these, oh, this is quite a big one. Yeah, but these are 30, in the small um, pom-pom bag, we've got 35 and 45 mil pom-poms. Oh, okay. So that's quite, that probably is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So that's it. Lovely. So that's you, well, that's you brilliant. Thank do. you so much. That's quite all right. Um, thank you for coming in on a Sunday. I know. At least it wasn't snowing. You I know. Thank goodness. Thank when goodness. are you back with um, us? Another Sunday. Oh, okay. Yeah, the 12th of December. Oh, I know. I don't so I'll see you then. then. Well, thanks so much. It's been That's brilliant. Right. Love working with all you. All right. Thank um, you. Right. I will be back here in a few minutes time for our final black tag hour where we've got loads and loads of lovely deals price crashing lots of new items for you to see don't forget 10 percent off day if there's anything that you've got in your basket please remember to check out because it does go very quickly if you go onto sewingstreet.com look on click on watch live and scroll down so that you can get ahead because a lot of our fabrics and items are going very quickly and people are getting disappointed anyway thank you for joining me so far and i will see you back in a couple of minutes
Hello, my name is Mark Francis and I'm a guest designer right here on Sewing Street. Uh, you may have seen me before. I don't know whether anybody has maybe tuned into the Great British Sewing Bee, but I was there for Series 6 reaching the quarterfinals. I'm now here on Sewing Street on your screens bringing you my very favourite sewing patterns for men, women and children. Uh, for dressmaking and tailoring. Uh, so you can fill your stash and your collection with my very favourite fabrics and sewing patterns, including my very own range uh, right here, exclusive to Sewing Street. Something you may not know about me, now let's have a think. A lot of this has been covered on the sewing bee, but uh, I am a Blue Peter badge winner. I know, I know. I haven't worn it in a while. Slightly too old to get into Warwick Castle these days wearing it. But you never, I don't know, do I pass for 16? I don't know, possibly not anymore. Um, and I'm also, hence the piano, uh, a pianist I've been playing since the age of seven, when my school teacher at the time taught me a little under duress from my mother because he thought I would be terrible. Turned out I wasn't, but there we go. Such is life, you never know until you give it a go. <gasps> Have I just invented a new catchphrase? I don't know. You never know until you give it a go. Caption across the screen, please. Thank you very much. So do join me popping up on your screens on here on Sewing Street to bring you my very favourite sewing patterns uh, and fabrics from across the range, including my very own uh, range of sewing patterns from So Mark Francis, um, including this very Turlow shirt. Um, more to come on a regular basis, so do keep tuned for that. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there. We know that shopping online can be a confusing and sometimes daunting task, and sometimes all you want to do is talk to a human being. Well, our family-run customer service team are on call 24-7. They're full of friendly, warm-hearted individuals, all trained to make your shopping experience as easy and as enjoyable as possible. And not only will they take your order, they will also help and guide you on your shopping journey, so you never miss out. If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one p and even if you check out multiple times in one day. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433. And for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. 
Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favorite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos, and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. And welcome back to Sewing Street for more fantastic black tag deals. This is the final day of our Black Friday weekend. Um, yesterday, we had 10% off everything. It was so popular that they decided to do it again today, which is brilliant. So we, not only do we have special deals where we've taken money off uh, the normal price that we've been selling them at, we haven't done anything different or odd. This is the normal stock that we sell but we've taken money off but also today it's 10% off everything 10% off everything on the website everything that I've talked about on air sewing machines everything except for gift vouchers we can't take 10% off that but other than that it is 10% off everything the way the logistics of it works is that the 10% will be taken off your whole basket so if you put the 10% in code in which is BF2021 at at the beginning or the middle or the end of your shop, it doesn't matter, but it will be taken off everything. If for any reason something you're, it hasn't worked or maybe you finished shopping but you fo forgot to put the code in, just give the call centre a ring. There's the number at the bottom, 0800 001 4433. They'll be able to help you. But it is 10% off everything and it means also that any of the deals that we've given you, any of the special prices or any of the clearance prices or money off, it's 10% off that as well. Otherwise, it got too complicated. It was the only way to do it. Anyway, so I've what's been what you have loved today is our pre-cuts, and we've got more for you here, more for you. So, should we start with? Sorry, <laughs> Riley Blake. Love Riley Blake. This one is called Pure Delight. Look at that. If you look at the colours there. It's Gorgeous, isn't it? Now let me show you what you get in here. So these are all two and a half inch strips cut across from selvage to selvage, so they're 44 inches wide. And there are, I'm just checking how many are in this one, it's usually 42. 40. Okay, it's 40, 42, 44. Um, so look at the colours in here. We've got blues, they're all really pretty florals, pale blue, dark blue, red, pinks, going through to yellows and whites and greys. Look, so full price was forty nine ninety nine. Ten pounds off, thirty nine ninety nine. Oh, but um, that Hannah's going to take some more off. So it's now thirty four ninety nine. So you've taken fifteen pounds off that. That's amazing. Oh, and it's ten percent day. So you take another three pound forty nine off there. So that's eighteen pound forty nine off. Fantastic. Off a of Riley Blake design roll. That's gorgeous. Look at all the colours in there. They're beautiful, aren't they? I have got another one. Mm -hmm. This one is called Tea with B. Oh, this is lovely, isn't it? Let me show you around this one. Go all the way around. Floral. I love the um, the green in that. It's a real sort of khaki green. You've got mustard. It features uh, bees and honeycombs. And you've got other. You've got bees there. You've got blacks. This lovely teal colourway. It's got teacups. A bit of coral and pink. That's beautiful. That one, isn't it? So full price forty nine ninety nine. How much is that one today then, Hannah? That's gorgeous, isn't it? Forty nine ninety. Oh, it's coming! It's coming down. How much is it coming down to? Thirty four ninety nine. Well, it had to be the same as the other one. And remember, remember that will be three pound forty nine off once you use your code as well. Really, that's an amazing price, isn't it, for a Riley break? Lowest ever price for a Riley Blake jelly roll. That's fantastic. Um, another one. 
Nether One. Oh, this is called Land of Liberty. Oh, I'm getting told off and moving on too quick again. It's that buffet. It's the cheese and pineapple. This is nice, isn't it? This is all, this is your very traditional red, white and blue. So you've got stars and stripes and gingham. But it's nice, isn't it? What I like, it's not just your red, white, blue. You've got shades of blue and different shades of red. And some of them have got um, text on them as well. It's called Land of Liberty. Lovely, isn't it? Look at this. So if you're thinking Union Jack, bit of... I know it's got American flags, but you could... But not loads of them. It's more red, white and blue, to be honest. We've got floors as well. But if you love that red, white and blue effect, it's lovely. You know, you, and the thing is with Jenny Rolls, you can make quilts with them. There are special books and patterns for them. But they're really good to use for sashings and strips and board. Brilliant for bindings because they're exactly the right width for a double fold bold binding. So if you want a quarter of an inch binding, if you two, use a two and a half inch strip, Fold it in half wrong sides together. You can use that to bind the edge of a quilt. And when you've got all of these, you can join them end to end for a nice multicolour binding. That's actually what I use a lot of my jelly rolls for because I love a multicolour binding. And you get that nice double fold, which makes your quilts much stronger on the edge. So this one has gone down to 34 99 as well. <gasps> Hannah, are you going to be in trouble? I think she's going to get in trouble for doing that. She wasn't supposed to. Let's hope they're not watching. They might be up now, though. She so might be in trouble. Don't tell. Don't tell. So those are the Riley Blake jelly rolls. Can I move on now? I have to ask now because I get in trouble. Aurafil Essentials. Is that this one? <whistles> this is what it looks like in the cling film. It will, you, yours will come wrapped in cling film. I'm going to show you what it looks like. Right, so this is, let's have a look first. Patrick Lou's Essentials. Oh, it's got a nice magnetic bit at the front. Do you love, I love packaging. Oh, <gasps> look at that. 45 spools of Aurifil thread, 50 weight. So that's your normal, normal sewing weight. This is when you're 10%. So normal price, 189.99. And we're going to take £10 off, just because. Because Hannah's feeling in a good mood. £179.99 plus your 10% ten, your ten off means you are getting £17.99. So therefore, you're getting £27.99 off that. Now, you can. it's a beautiful set. Beautiful to buy for yourself. Lovely as a gift. If you want to split it and spread the pay, you can do it with um, three equal payments of 59.99. You will be sent it straight away. You get the payment. It's interest free if you split the pay. Um, you don't have to do that. But isn't this beautiful? Now, 50 weight thread is your normal thread. There are different weights of thread, but for your normal sewing thread for seams and hems and all that sort of thing, that is your 50 weight thread. It's um, 45 spools, all these beautiful colours, 220 yards per spool. I mean, Aurifil thread is gorgeous. It's Egyptian long staple cotton, which means it's very strong. And although it's 50 weight and it's the same weight as other brands of thread, it feels, it's very odd, it feels finer and smoother. When you use Aurifil thread in your machine, you don't get all those little fluffs and bobbles. It's gorgeous, and I think the colours are amazing. They're always very vivid and strong. I mean, I use them a lot when I'm doing quilting or top stitching because I like to save my Aurifil thread because it's so beautiful. And I use it when I want to use it for embellishment and to really make something stand out. But it is very strong and it is very beautiful. And a massive saving. But that £10 off and the 10% off will only be until midnight tonight. Do remember that. So that is something. What a beautiful gift. If you've used Aurifil, you will need, know how wonderful it is. If you has a, haven't, honestly, it's worth it. Sometimes you do get what you pay for, and with Aurifil thread, you do. That's gorgeous. But it is very limited. Mug! Mug! 
Very important, this comes in a very nice box, which makes it very good for gifting. It is dishwasher and microwave safe. It is also, doesn't have to be used as a mug. Let me get it out. It's very good for storage as well. It's just fun, isn't it? Look at it. Everyone who's bought one so far has multi-bought. Look, what a lovely gift to give to your sewing friends. Perfect. I have one like this, similar to this, and I have it on my sewing table and I have all my marking pens in it. It's a really nice storage thing. We do sell hundreds of these. So this is another weird one. Why are we reducing this? So for these black tag um, skeptics who say, oh yeah, it's just all a con. It isn't. This is just our normal stock that we're reducing the price. We have reduced it in the past once to eight ninety nine on a special offer day. Yeah, let's reduce it to seven ninety nine, and then obviously seventy nine pence off when you use your um, ten percent off code. I love it. Purple hand has got scissors all over it. Really good for a pen pot as well as using it as a mug because it does work. But look, it goes all the way around. Look. So if you're left-handed, works. It's lovely. And I like the fact it comes in a box. So if you want to gift it to somebody, it always looks a bit better, doesn't it? And then what you could do is if you gift that to somebody, um, you could put a little fat quarter of fabric in there, couldn't you? Or something like that, if it was for a sewer. Yeah, put two um, hot chocolates, a fries Turkish delight in a fat quarter of fabric, and then you can post it to me. Fries Turkish like happens to be my favourite chocolate. Or I tell you what, you know those um quality street ones? You could put those, fill it with those, those big purple ones. Basically food. Actually, I saw the other day in one of the coffee shops they were doing big purple one quality street hot chocolates. Oh. <gasps> Hannah said if you go in there and get one they give you the sweet at the end oh i'm gonna have to go in anyway that would uh, match it beautifully wouldn't it but it's for 7.99 plus the 79 pence that you're going to get off that's a fantastic price but they are going fast so please if you do want one of these beautiful mugs you need to put it in your basket and you need to check out and in the bottom of the box it's very safe so if you wanted to post it well i mean you need to be thinking about the packaging that's not good is it um i was trying try to get the camera to see it because it's going I was trying to get it, but I couldn't get it by the right way. But there's a little space for the handle and the mug, so it actually fits in very securely. Look at the box, good about putting it back in its little box. There we go. So if you wanted to post it, that would help, wouldn't it? Anyway. Next. <laughs> I'm so impatient. So patient. Hannah's not as, not as fast as I am. Up next. <laughs> the autumn flowers panel. Oh, I've got a few panels here. I think it's this one. Ooh, Riley Blake panel. Do like a panel. Right, this is called autumn flowers. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? Shall I hold it? If I hold it up, can you see? Can you see the bottom? That's as high as I can get my arms. Can you see? I can't stretch my arms up any higher than that. Right. My arms are aching now. I'll have to come down. No! <laughs> my arms are aching. I love this. What a beautiful vase of flowers. And then at the bottom, autumn, the year's last loveliest smile. Oh, that's so nice, isn't it? So you could just use this as a wall hanging or you could border it. Scent of a quilt, it would look beautiful. If you put strips around it, I mean, you could keep it as simple as putting strip, just fabric strips around it. Or you could do pieced ones with triangles and half square triangles and all that sort of thing. But it's just beautiful, isn't it? This is it's a big panel. Fifteen ninety nine is its usual. Usual price has never been lowered. It's Riley Blake just saying, which means it's beautifully soft, fantastic quality. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Fifteen ninety nine. 
How much can we take off this one then, Hannah? $9.99. That's amazing. Under £10 plus take another 99 pence off that. £9. £9 for that beautiful panel. It's gorgeous, isn't it? I think it'd be lovely in the centre of a duvet cover, wouldn't it? It's asking to be quilted, though, isn't it? You go around the edge of here. It's just a thing. Quilt around the edge of the vase. It's lovely, isn't it? Autumn, the year's last loveliest smile. Love the autumn. But at least we're still in autumn. It's funny, all the leaves on the trees near me, have, have all, most of them have fallen off. And then with the wind yesterday, they all sort of like got blown into great banks. And the dog just kept jumping into them and disappearing. So that's, can I do the other two panels? Right. These, I think, are Riley Blake as well, aren't they? Yes. Ooh. This is Caravans. So on this panel, we've got one, two, three, four... Five, six, so we've got eight rectangles. We'll go through them in a minute. And then we've got a central one. Our journey is not measured in miles, but in adventures and friends we make along the way. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? Let me move that out of the way. Isn't that lovely? So this is $9.99 normal price. We've got a caravan, two caravans. We've got a back of a truck. Whenever we are together, that is home. Wherever we are together, that is home. That's lovely. But, you know, you could you can use this as a wall hanging. It would make a beautiful wall hanging. Or you cut it up and use it for the bits that you want to. So those are the top ones. Then we've got that centre. And then there's four more at the bottom. Let's go and have an adventure. So I say these, these oh, price is going down. $9.99, reducing to $7.99. $7.99, minus 79 pence for your 10% off. BF 2021. <laughs> but you could use these individually to put onto the centres of cushions. You could quilt the whole thing. You could just use one part of it. Not all of them have got words and sayings. You know, if you know somebody, if you wanted um, cushions for your caravan, it'd be perfect for that, wouldn't it? There's just so many different options, but for 7 99 minus 79 pence, that's really, really good value. But it would make just, it would be nice just to hang up. I know it's all about travel, but to hang up in your house, because wherever we are together, that is home. Lovely leaving present for somebody, especially if they were leaving in a caravan. Okay. <laughs> or going travelling. It's lovely, and I really like that. And it's Riley Blake, beautiful. Joy in the journey. Is this one the same? Right. Next one. I think... This next one is the same, it's just got a different. Right, so this one is the same. This one is the same, but it just has an olive border. I'm just checking, I think the caravans might be slightly different colour as well. No, the caravan's a different colour. So this one has a diff, it's just a different colourway. It has the same words. The caravans are slightly different colours and the border is in, in an olive, but the words are the same. Let's go and have an adventure. How much is this one? Seven ninety nine as well? Okay, I missed the price crash. I missed the price crash. I must have been looking down. <coughs> I was checking out the caravans. It's lovely, isn't it? It's like I'm all the way up to the top so you can see. I'm just not tall enough to be able to hold it up so you can see it. Our journey is not measured in miles. Oh, that's so pretty, isn't it? Makes you think of going on holiday in the summer. Do you think that'll happen? But you know, you, you think what you, you could use all of these for. For your, it could be like your, your holiday 
kit, your little holiday wash kit. You could cut out the front. That one could be the front of it and that one could be the back of it. Put your holiday underwear in. Or you could use it like, you know, for your holiday, a travel wallet for putting your tickets in and your passport. If you use the front and the back, you made them into a zip case, you could keep all your travel documents in there. You'd look really cool then when you get to the ferry port or the airport and someone go, oh, look, at my, look at my travel wallet with caravans. Let's go and have an adventure. It would make a really nice travel wallet. Right, that's that one. Right, so from that collection, is that that one? Yes. So we do have some fabrics from that caravan collection. So if you want some extra fabrics because you think, oh, I'm going to use those panels for something else, we have got fabrics from this collection. I don't think it's called the caravan collection. It's called Joy in the Journey. So, lots of caravans. Now, this is available by the half metre. So, if you want more than a half a metre, we will cut it to order. You put, If you want, say, two metres, put four units in your basket and we will cut it and it will be sent to you as one whole two metre piece. You won't be sent four individual ones. So, the normal price is seven forty nine because it's Riley Blake, it's designer fabric. But today, and today only, the price is five ninety nine. Five ninety nine for half a metre. And don't forget as well, with your ten percent off code, that's another fifty nine pence. BF twenty twenty one, because we're your best friend, your best fa best fabric, twenty twenty one. So this features all the caravans that are on that panel. You've got the little caravan, you've got the back of the truck, you've got the tent, the flowers. I think, I think we have the same fabric. I'm just checking. I'm going to try and do it in colourways. To make it simpler. Oh, yes. Oh, I've got it in two more colourways. Okay, so that's the green one. The problem is going to be choosing. Now I've got it with the white. Well, I would go, I, I would say it's not bright white, it's sort of an ivory cream. Same one. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah, Hannah's going to make some kitchen curtains out of these. It's very pretty, isn't it? But for all anything to do with travel, I love that idea of... Or if you want to make a sun hat. But, you know, hopefully, the going on holiday is the one thing that we do do every year. So you can make yourself some little items for that. Or, you know, if somebody's going on... Lovely to make for a gift for a birthday present, isn't it? When you, if you make a little bag for them. A just a little cosmetic toiletry bag, but with the caravans on it. I love pictorial fabric because it sort of inspires you of things you can make. So that is five ninety nine for half a meter. I have it now in mint, which sounds like green, but it's not. It's sort of a bluey, a bluey green. There we go. So that one is five ninety nine. So if you want to see, if you can't choose, I'll show you what they look like together. There's the mint. There's the cream. And there's the green. They go well together, though, don't they? So if you were thinking you wanted to make something like a bag or something, you wanted a lining, it'd be nice to quite have the two. I have got other fabrics in the caravan range. It was not called that. Joy, joy of the journey. I'm calling it the caravan range if you want some others to go with it. So those are those three. Now, if you want just scattered caravans, caravans in the wind, we've got it in mint. What is this one actually called? Oh, just Mint Caravan. I thought it might have a name on the edge or something that was unusual. Mint Caravans. These are really sweet, aren't they? So, again, if you wanted to use them as a matching thing to go with one of the others, travel wash bag or lining of, 
or shirt, nice summer dress, very pretty. A-line skirt, I'm always saying that, but I love an A-line skirt in a print, because then you can just buy a plain t-shirt and it looks lovely. And A-line skirts are very forgiving, aren't they, because they don't have waistbands. I do like some, a skirt without a waistband. Right, so that's it in mint. Right, we've also got it in green. Is it called green or is it called olive? Olive. Five ninety nine again, and remember you'll get the extra fifty nine pence off because it's ten percent off day. Best fabric twenty twenty one BF twenty twenty one. If you want um, the ten percent, if you want to add the ten percent off, you want it. If you want to remember to add the ten percent off. That's the green one. Now we've also got it in pink and then I'll show you them together. And you have to choose or just get them all. The pink is the most limited one though. Again, that was 7.49, but that's now coming down to 5.99. 5.99 for half a metre. I mean, you think Riley Blake, designer fabric, that's amazing. We've, we haven't sold this at that price before at all. So there's the pink and the green and the mint. There we go. All five ninety nine for half a meter. It's an amazing value, isn't it? Do you think you're getting two pounds off plus the ten percent? That's a good sale. And I think they're very generous that you've managed to get the money off and the 10% off as well on the same day. Right. Yes, so more in this range that are big, <coughs> sorry, that are big flowers. This one, oh, that's nice, isn't it? I love that one. That's lovely, isn't it? So you've got a really lovely jet black background, but with these really vibrant flowers. I mean, you know, this this obviously blends beautifully with the other fabrics because you think, well, it's got all that black in it. But when you look at this one, you know, all of the outlines and the all the main details are in black. So it does blend beautifully if you wanted fabric to go with it. However, it stands alone as well, really well, because it's just the floral element of it. It's very, very pretty. Five ninety nine. Because remember, you know, I know it's quilting weight fabric, but think summer dressmaking. Perfect for that. Think of home, home stings, home thing. No, don't think of, no. Think of homeware, bags, works well. And lining, you know, making a bag lining out of something like this is so pretty. Makes quite a difference, doesn't it? You know, I know you can use plain fabrics in it, but it is beautiful, so just half a metre. Um, I've also got this same fabric in two other colourways. I'm guessing this one's called cream. That's very limited. It's very pretty, isn't it? Doesn't it look different? I'll show you all three of them together in a minute. But I think the black leaves are quite stunning. They add a real sense of style to this fabric because the flowers are very sort of peachy pinks and the blues and the yellows. But I do like the fact they've got, well, they've got green leaves, but the black leaves really make it striking, quite stand out. Again, 5 99 for half a metre. And then finally in, the, in that section, it has a pink background. This one has been really popular on pre-order. But don't worry, if you've bought anything on pre-order at 7.49, you will be charged because your baskets don't get um, charged till midnight. You will get charged the lowest price, 5.99. So don't worry if you've bought it earlier than that, that when the baskets all get sorted out at midnight, you will be charged the lowest price. So that's the one with the pink background. Now, if you love that fabric, but you can't decide which one, I'm going to show you them together. Right, so that's what they all look like together. Because I love seeing it. when you get a collection and you see the different colourways, you work out sometimes, you can see how they look balanced together and whether you want more than one or which one you prefer. 
but they do look really well. It's, it's really interesting on this one how the flowers really stand out as individual elements. Whereas on this one, because the background is similar to the fabrics, it's much more of an all over effect. I think that's lovely. So please do, this one is extremely popular. If you want this one, you need to put it in your basket, you need to check out. It's been really popular on pre-order as well. 5 99 Okay. Um, I think I've got, they're singing, they're singing. Are you singing, guys? They're singing Christmas songs as well. I've got, I think there's two more, three more fabrics from this range in the same colourways but a different print. And then you will have seen the whole range. Um, let's start with the black one. So similar as in you've got the, the black background, similar flowers but all tiny. So you've got a different scale of print on this one. Again, this one has been reduced to 5 99 So we're getting really close. But remember, when you're doing anything miniature like EPP or applique and you want tiny, tiny prints, this is perfect for it. When you're making those little hexes and you just want a small scale of print or when you're thinking, I want to use a plain fabric and we're multi-directional, doing lots of patchwork, like half square triangles, that kind of thing, where you need just an all over print. This is quite pretty. But let me show you how nice it looks with its friend, its partner. So that's the large print version and the small print version. So when you're thinking, you know, maybe you would want to make um, a bag that has a different colour base, maybe. That looks lovely at the top, but you want a plainer base at the bottom. That works really well together. Because the two prints flow. It's, always, it's often it's very, very difficult, isn't it, when you try to match colours with fabrics from different ranges trying to get the sort of the same elements and the same colours, but you know these go together. So that's its matching friend. That one's almost sold out, so if you want it, you need to quickly check out. Um, I have the same fabric, but in cream. Very fresh, very spring and floral. Look at that, isn't that pretty? Very summer, summer blouse. I know it's winter, well, it's not autumn, I know it's cold, but, you know, Black Friday is the time, well, Black, Fly, Black Weekend is the time to start purchasing things that you can use for next year, while you can. But it's very, yes, little girl as well, isn't it? Little sun hats. You know those little bucket hats? You need to get patterns for quite easily. Look beautiful in that, wouldn't it? Little rucksack, pretty beautiful little rucksack that's the cream background again 5.99 and then this is the pink one so if you've bought the big one loads and loads of the pink has gone oh, actually i've got the cream one there shall i show you it with its big friend They're so pretty, aren't they? It's those colours, isn't it? It's by, it's get, if you've bought one of them to get the matching one, because the blue, I mean, this peachy pink colour is very, very specific, and the blues, and they just match together beautifully. And then if you were, there's the cream one with his friend, the cream's big sister. But they're really lovely for when with this very small prints, you know, for things like EPP or for doing bindings, particularly like things like necklines. If you've got a white T-shirt and you want to do something a bit different, a, a, a small um, narrow binding in a small print makes it look beautiful. I had a crew neck T-shirt I didn't really like, so I cut it down into a scoop neck and I bound it with a very small floral print. It looked really lovely. Or, or just around the cuff or a little bit on the hem. It's little, small prints like that work ever so well for small bindings or small areas like that. Or if you want to do, you, instead of using a plain fabric, it just adds a bit more detail to it. So that is the end of the Riley Blake, the end of the Riley Blake range. The loads of, if you have a look on the website, click on um, Watch Live and scroll down from there. Then you can have a look, because sometimes you, when you've looked, seen them all, I've shown you them all, it gets all a bit like, oh, I'm not, I can't remember which one I want. But if you have a look on the website, you'll see. Now, this is very popular. 
So if you do want it, I would suggest you put it in your basket and check out. Always pop your code in. You only need to do it once and you will get the 10% off taken off. Santa is next. Santa is next. Right, I'm going to fold these up though. Otherwise, get just confused. So there's all the Miley Blakes. Right, Santa. We've got three, three. The but just different colourways. Should we start with charcoal? Charcoal Santa. There is still time to make things before Christmas. It is only November. These are again Riley Blake, really cute vintage. This is your vintage Santa, isn't it? I love this. This is perfect for your Christmas gift bags, isn't it? Or napkins. Remember, half a meter makes two napkins. And they love it. It's only only five pound forty nine for half a meter. Beautiful quality. I think when if you're using quilting weight cotton for anything like tableware or dress or um, dressmaking particularly, you need to think about the drape of it. It has to have this, and the Riley Blake is, it has a beautiful drape. It's very soft to feel. I bought some beautiful table mats last year that were all vintage. This kind of style, they had like old trucks on them, and that, th this, that effect is really popular at the moment. Now, we've got this one in three colourways, so if you were thinking, yeah, I'd, I'd like the idea of making a table run or a set of napkins or some gift bags to put on my table, um, if you want to for a bit of a matching section rather than buying all the same fabric. That's it in the charcoal, but it's also, and I'll show them together, available in the green, which is a, like a fur green, an olivey fur colour. Quarter of the stock of this one sold out on pre-order. It is lovely, isn't it? But it does, and, and it's even that vintage green sort of feel. Or, you know, when you, if you're having people round for Christmas dinner and you want to make little table presents, make them a little drawstring bag. You just cut, chuck a couple of chocolates in it. Right, so these are supposed to be 5 99 but no. Um, 5 49 5 49 for half a metre. It's lovely, isn't it? Or if you think if you're going to make yourself a Christmas tree skirt, it'd be nice to use that for it, wouldn't it? And also, finally, we have it with the cream background. I'll just show you this one so you can have a good look at it and then I'll show you what they look like together. Christmas at Buttermilk Acres. Right, so if you, if you need to decide now, I'm going to put them together. There's the cream one, there's the green one and there's the charcoal one. But they do work really well, obviously. The colours, although you know they're different, they when these are designed, when these fabric ranges are designed, they, they are designed so that the colourways do go together. That any of you little Christmas makes, they're perfect for. But you could put, you know, you know, it's like a or say at Christmas when you've made people jams or chutneys and you want to put um a lid on it where you just cut a circle of fabric don't forget to cut it with the pinking shears and you tie around the top that would look lovely with it wouldn't it i think they're really just very charming or a tie make a christmas tie christmas pajamas you know at 549 for half a meter you could even make just little short pajamas they're lovely aren't they right So on the cream one, we are limited in stock for that. So if you do want the cream one, you need to check out for that one. I mean, to be honest, most of the items that we've had and sold today are very limited in stock because the price does go back up after midnight. And the 10% off disappears as well. Right, so I've got two more fabrics. Oh. Those are which I've got three, sorry, I thought they were the same colour. There's the gold. Oh, ooh, that's very nice. What's that one called then? Classic. That's beautiful, isn't it? So that one is 749. Well, was 749. Beautiful, bright white fabric with um gold, metallic gold printing of flowers all over it. 
I don't know whether it's Christmassy or not. That's five ninety. Oh, that one has sold out. Right. I, but I have got it in the red. Now, I don't know whether this is a Christmas range, but it just is beautifully classic. Oh, that's... It's gorgeous. It doesn't have to be Christmas, but I think if you wanted to use it for Christmas things, because it is really bright white with the contrast of this red it looks like you know when you get things that are sketched um etch is it called like etchings with all the lines it looks like that black and whiteness but it's beautiful isn't it so it would work really well for christmas items because it is very classic red and white but it doesn't have to be it's certainly not a christmas range it's just called classic that's beautiful isn't it so 5.99 for half a meter let me open it out so you can see what the whole thing i'll hold it out for you look really lovely isn't it and again you've got that Riley Blake quality which is always nice smooth and drapeable but I do have one of another gold one that hasn't sold out but a different pattern what is this pattern oh it's like leaves and birds oh IFYV97. Oh, I think that one sold out. <gasps> um, which one is that one? That one. Thread. Let's move on to thread. Um... I want to try and open this. Am I allowed to open this one? No, I'm not going to open it because we've got a picture. There's a picture. So this is six large spools of Aurifil thread. 100% cotton, obviously. It's the 50 weight thread, so your normal, normal weight. Five, no, six. Six spools. Orange, charcoal, light, a very sort of um, vanilla cream, olive, purple and blue but these are extra large ones 1422 yards so the normal price for those is 47.99 for the six reels of thread but obviously it's black tag hour so it's not that it's 39.99 and don't forget with the code BF2021, that's another £3.99 off the £39.99 for six large spools. And you know what it's like when you're making something. And I was making something yesterday. I filled my bobbin three times. So three times. So a normal spool wouldn't, if you're making something big, it's really good to have these, um, to have these size ones. Hoffman Challenge. Celebrating 95 years of Hoffman fabric. Ah, oh, okay. Gorgeous. Nice present. Or if you need to increase your Aurifil stash, it is nice to, nice to have these large spools. So each spool has got 1,300 metres. And if Aurifil thread, beautiful to use. Beautiful. We are now in single figures for this thread because that is a fantastic price. Don't forget the price goes back up and again at midnight and there will be no more 10% off either. Okay. This one. And I've got another Aurifil thread. Now this is slightly different. This is dressmaking essentials. So there are 10 small spools. I think I can open this one. But they're different weights because they're used for different things. So they are, it does tell you what they are on them. They're 12 weight, 28 weight, 40 weight and 50 weight. This one we have never reduced before. So these are perfect for, you've got um, threads that are used for top stitch and some for fine stitching. The 50 weight is your normal sewing. It's a really good way if you want to try different weight threads. It's a really good way. So 50 weight, um, the higher the number, the thinner the thread. So these get thinner, finer, not thinner, finer. These have been reduced to 25.99. So you've got some threads in here, like the, the um, which one, the 12 weight, that are really good for decorative, like <coughs> shashko stitching. 
You've got other threads that are brilliant for top stitch. And so look at this. You've got, you know, the colours that are really good for just general um, navy, black, grey. But then you've got these top stitching threads, which are brilliant for denim in the sort of the oranges and the ochres. But that's so if you haven't used Oriflame thread and you'd like to have a go in your dressmas, dressmaking essentials. These have been chosen by Jenny Smith, who is a fantastic dressmaker, who knows what threads you need for what. So this is a brilliant starter set. £25.99, don't forget you'll get £2.59 off that using your 10% off BF2021 code. Okay? Nice. These. Right, we have got more fabric panels, mindful mandalas. I would like to say I'd hold it out, but I don't think you'll be able to see it. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. That is gorgeous, isn't it? It looks, the way that it looks, it looks like you're falling into a hole, doesn't it? I'm thinking if this was mine, I would quilt that and I'd put that on the floor as a rug, as a mat. So this was $17.99. It's now been reduced to $14.99. <coughs> and obviously you get £1.49 off that. But that looks like you're sort of falling into a hole or a pond. What a brilliant centre to a quilt. Or just a mat to go on the floor. I think that's absolutely gorgeous. But really, so, you know, if you want a piece of beautiful, modern wall art, that's amazing, isn't it? There's something about the perspective of that that does actually draw you in. So as a piece of wall art, that's beautiful. Just quilt it, put a binding on, job done. Lovely. I like the idea of putting it on the floor, though, because you would feel like you were falling into a hole. hole. I love those um, illusion quilts that look like um, labyrinths. That gives you the same sort of effect. Um, right, I've got another one. Pink. This is the same, the same hole, only in a different colour. Oh, that's gorgeous. I do it in the, and it, it's like the centre of a volcano or something. That centre section. It looks like, I don't know, it's this, it is like a piece of art because you keep looking at it. And then I think it looks like car tyres or big lorry tyres because you've got this darker section around here. That makes this section here look like it's domed. Clearly it's not, it's flat. But there's something about the way it's done, but it looks like a dome, like a big line. I mean, it's just stunning, isn't it? Beautiful panel. But it does have, I mean, it is cut on the edge, so you do have a section on here. So this goes... This one's selvage to selvage here. But then you do have a white section, so it is a set panel. It's not just cut off to the metre. I really want to be able to hang this up, but I'm not tall enough to even hang it on the wall. <laughs> it's gorgeous, though, isn't it? Right, I've got one more colourway of that. Oh, the next one is a bit different. Is it a hole? This one is a this one is a different hole. So hang fire before you choose. I'm thinking student bedroom wall. You know how they're not allowed to hang things up. Brilliant for that. A bit of blue tack. It's not very heavy. Ooh, very different. Or centre of a bed cover. You could just border this with plain black, to be honest. You know, you're always trying to think, oh, I'd like to make a quilt for somebody, oh, but, you know, will they like that? Is it a bit too traditional? If they like a bit of modern art, that's gorgeous, isn't it? £14.99 minus £1.49. I love that. Very diff different again. But the pictures of all of these are on the website, so if you can't decide which one you want, have a look to choose. But these are going quite fast, so you do need to check out and pop it in your basket. Right, I'm going to, gosh, we've only got five minutes left. So tomorrow, 
tomorrow. Tomorrow on Sewing Street. It's me. It's me. I'm back tomorrow. It's Monday. I'm back tomorrow. So eight o'clock in the morning, we've got black tag deals. Yay. Oh, because it's Cyber Monday. Of course it is. I get so confused. It's Cyber Monday. So eight o'clock, we have black tag deals. At nine o'clock, we've got Barbara McLean, who's going to be showing us how to be make the rondelle bag in several different colorways so that'd be lovely it's a really nice bag that one um stuart's in with me at 10 o'clock with his christmas tote this is brand new i've seen it and it's gorgeous brand new with me tomorrow um with stuart that'll be lovely get some hints and tips from him and it is a beautiful bag um 11 barbara's back with debbie shaw's kitchen making some projects from that book and at 12 o'clock it's yarn lane with cyber monday deals that's fab isn't it looking forward to tomorrow i will be with you eight o'clock in the morning um just want to pop over to the other desk to show you the kit that we have for this beautiful tula pink checkmate quilt now this was on yesterday do we have a picture of it i'm never going to hold this up it's really, really big. Now, what's beautiful about this quilt is it features all of her, um, oh, is it? Oh, all the Wonderland fabric. I'll show you the cover there, look. Have you got the picture? Okay. It's got a lot of fabric in there. Look, there's the quilt there. I mean, that's and it is absolutely stunning. Now, this isn't on a black tag deal, but we wanted to put it in for you because it's 249.99. But with that 10% off, that's quite a lot, isn't it? That makes quite a big difference, 24.99. It is beautiful. Now, remember, because it is a considered purchase, it is a beautiful quilt. This is this quilt will keep you going for quite some time, and it is an absolute work of art. Um, you can split it over three split payments. If you want to watch back the demo, if you missed um, watching it yesterday, it was on yesterday at, at, at 11 o'clock, so you can see it being demoed. But just in case you missed it, for you know these higher price quilts, the 10% off really does make a difference. You get so much fabric in the box that we couldn't shut it. The fabric, obviously, all the fabric you need, clearly, and all the instructions are in there. I mean, it is beautiful, isn't it? Now, I've also got, I've got, I've got another quilt. We didn't, this one wasn't demonstrated yesterday, but again, this is just an example we wanted to show you, because remember the 10% is off of everything that I've talked about today and off the website. Now, obviously, if you're getting your 10% off a black tag deal, even better. But just to show you, I mean, well, I'll try. This is one of our cave quilts. It's upside down. I'm turning it round. There we go. So have a look on the website for all the details of it. But the normal price of this quilt is $149.99. So if you use your 10% code, that's $14.99. It makes quite a difference for these larger value quilts. So if you've always thought, I'd love to make a cave quilt, then maybe today's the day because 10% won't be tomorrow. I don't think. No, no, had it confirmed. 10% won't be. And if you love designs like cake, just have a look on the website. Go on to www.sewingstreet.com. Have a look in our kit section. And everything that we've shown is on Watch Live. But if you have a look in the kit section, you can go and see designer kits. You can see all the different ones and you can search that way. Or just right at the top cave. But if you want to have a look and you think, well, you know what, that's 10%. That's a fantastic deal. It's worth it. I've thought about it, but it just makes a little bit of a difference. It is worth going and having a look. So thanks, everybody, for joining me today. I haven't um, presented a Sunday for ages. So it's been really nice, actually. It's like, yeah, just a nice, relaxed day. But we've had some fantastic deals, haven't we? Well done for everybody who's managed to check out and get it, because there's loads and loads of you that did miss out. Um, don't forget, if you 
I've got any questions about or whether you've forgotten to put the code in, you're not sure, just phone the call centre. They're really, really helpful. They'll be able to sort it out. You can shop at any time between now and midnight if you want to add some other um, items to your basket, you can. Anyway, stay in and stay warm. It's going to be a cold day. I'll see you back here tomorrow morning at 8am. Thank you for joining me today.